We see it all around us more and more every day. People with power punching down. But the Avengers weren't like that. I believed it in my core. I keep thinking, this has to have happened for a reason. Maybe this is what I've been waiting for. Maybe I'm finally part of something. Bigger. About time. Oh. These seats don't recline. It's so beautiful. Huh. Why call it the Golden Gate Bridge if it's not golden? There are so many other kids. I bet their stories are all amazing. Competition is what makes us strong. Mm. What if they don't like my story? What if it doesn't fit in? It's got to be perfect, you know? When you were born, your brother said you had googly eyes. What? But I thought your eyes were the most beautiful things I had ever seen. We are all unique, Kamala. You should be proud of who you are. I love you, Abu. I love you more. And I'm pretty sure you're gonna win this thing. Oh, could you imagine? I'm the winner for best fan fiction ever is Avengers versus the evil sewer lizards by Kamala Khan and the crowd goes wild. <sighs> That's the spirit. <laughs> hmm. Promise me something. Win or lose. Oh, I'll always be good, Abu. No oh, better. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. That's my girl. Folks, we're approaching the Avengers West Coast headquarters on the left, and we'll be touching down on the Chimera Sun. Hurry, Abu, let's go! All right, all right, hold your horses. Finalist. Can I get your name? Kamala Khan. And this is my dad. Yusuf. The Khans. Great. Make sure to check out our comic scavenger hunt. Collect all five and get access to the VIP balcony. Once you've collected them all, just scan your phone at the elevator and you're golden. Have fun. <laughs> Don't you have enough comic books? But the VIP balcony. I, I have to. Hit the red targets, but not the green. 150 points to win. No problem. Oh, darn. 
Are you okay? No. I already got this comic. I need the Captain America one to finish the set. Wait, if you get doubles, want to trade? <laughs> sure. Cool. See you later. I am Iron Man. I am Iron Man. So cool. No, this one's all out. Oh my gosh! Repulsor gloves! Oh man. Oh, oh this is so cool. Ah, what atrocity is this? Ah. Apologies. You are very small and hard to see. There is no need to cower before a son of Odin, though I understand the impulse. What is your name? Oh, Kamala Khan. Uh -huh. And what is that thing you are holding? Oh, it's a high-density muon beam. A Model 3 Repulsor Club. It's Tony Stark's first love. <laughs> Odin's beard. About as intimidating as the man himself, hmm? Oh, oh you're funny. <laughs> yes, I am. Behold, a true weapon that needs no improvement. Oh, my God. Whosoever holds this hammer, if he, if she, be worthy, shall possess the power of Thor. <laughs> Indeed. The difference between Stark's trinkets and the gods' might. I guess. But every hero has to start somewhere, right? <clears throat> yes. <laughs> yes, of course. You are very wise for one so young. Thanks. <laughs> so are you. <laughs> <laughs> Kamala Khan. Hmm. I will remember your name. Thunder. Mind blown. Ugh, comic books. Prize. Focus. Cap used in World War II to smash Hitler in the face. This is so cool. You're in the way. I'm, I'm sorry. This contest should only be for the real fans. <laughs> hey, what makes you think I'm not a real fan? I deserve to be here too. You really think that the Avengers read your little story? Get out of here. <laughs> In the press, in the whole world, tell you to move. You plant yourself like a tree beside the river of truth, and you say no. You move. What? Who said that? A real fan would. Yeah, whatever. Get out of here. You know, for what it's worth, I thought that was pretty brave. Uh, thanks. I'm guessing you're a Captain Marvel fan. She's <laughs> off planet, but she would have liked to meet you. I'm sorry, you're Captain America. I'm Kamala. Kamala Khan. Khan. Your story had the evil sewer... The sewer lizards, yeah. 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 Thor really got a kick out of that one. Said they actually had a sewer lizard problem on Asgard once. You read my story. Everyone submitted. 
That is so cool. Hey, Cap, we should head to the stage. Tarleton is losing his nerve. Have you seen Thor? He should be here by now. Uh, I saw him. I, I saw him, yeah. Uh, he was over at the Stark booth, but he's probably not there anymore because I saw him leave. <laughs> Who's the kid? Nat, allow me to introduce one of our esteemed contestants. This is Kamala Khan, expert on all things evil sewer lizard. Oh, all right. Hey, that thing you had me do with the storm drain cover? Pretty badass. <laughs> I mean, it's nothing compared to what happened between you and Madame Hydra. That was wild. <laughs> uh, we should head to the stage. Right. It's nice meeting you, Kamala. See you around, kid. I'll see you around. That was Captain America. The Aunt Black Widow. I'm, I'm dying. Yes! Two down! Can I try? <laughs> so close! Hey, almost worthy is still pretty good. Here's your comic. Oh, thanks! Another comic down! From the TVs. Terrigen was meant for the people, not some toy for billionaires. It still can be. Stay focused on what matters. Our work is going to change the world, George. I know you don't like the pageantry, but it will be worth it. He'll want control, profit. We won't let him. This is your moment. With Stark's funding and your mind, You'll be a hero to all those people. Can't you see? We are so close. There you are. Bruce. <laughs> you disappeared this morning. There's always work to be done. I know always. What is it? Nothing. It's some little thing. Just getting some strange readings off the, uh, the reactor. George... <sighs> Maybe you were right. Maybe we were too hasty to put this on public display. Do you think we could run over the numbers just one more time? Oh, uh, yeah, yes, certainly. Thank you. I'm so sorry. Hey, what are you doing back here? Uh-oh. I'm, um, I'm lost? Sure. Let's get you back to the main event, okay? Huh. I already have this one. Hold on. Maybe I could trade this one with that other kid. Hey, I got the comic you wanted. Awesome. Trade you. Pleasure doing business with you. Almost done. VIP balcony, here I come. balcony.
Director Fury. Director, aren't you concerned that your helicarrier's reactor might be incapable of containing this Terrigen? We know Trust nothing me. of it. We wouldn't be moving forward if this wasn't completely safe. The Chimera delivers the safety and protection of the Avengers and S.H.I.E.L.D. combined. Thank you. <gasps> Bruno's never gonna believe this. Whoa, hey kid, be careful. Oh. Okay. Beta, this is the elevator to your fancy balcony. It needs your phone scan. Do you have your comic books? Open sesame, comic book overlords! Get out of here. Come. Sounds pretty big for an accident. There are no accidents. Thor, Tony, check it out. At once. Try to keep up. Grab the Quinjet map. Just in case. On it. Yeah, obviously. We're gonna let you catch up. Whoa! This just got a whole lot more interesting. Let's make this quick. Where? Four, see if you can clear a path on the bridge. Alright. Go, go, go! We gotta use the Armed men out here! We need backup! Not worthy. Tony, Thor, what's your status? There are mortals trapped. Lots of small, angry men with guns. Uh, I just caught a bus. Maybe I should have had a bigger breakfast this morning. Thor, thanks for the assist. We got civilians trapped behind those barricades. Understood. Stay behind me. I will deal with them. We got you, Thor. This should be fun. Thor, who are we dealing with here? They did not introduce themselves. Hang on, those guns are shield issue. I'll get Commander Hill on the line. Cap, they picked today for a reason. Agreed, Bruce. I'm staying with the Chimera until we figure out what's going on. Thank you. Stay down. Help 
is on the way. Kill the guy. It's not ready for flight. Why is it moving? Someone's initiated the security protocols. The Chimera's autopilot has taken over. You'll need backup. We're heading back. Negative. Secure the bridge. Those weapons can't get into the city. Copy that. You're up, Bruce. Yeah. <sighs>
Bringing in the Quinjet for a landing. are dangerous, Stark. Hey, those weapons were meant for the good guys. Is that supposed to be a joke? Not the time. Get your heads in the game. Cap, what's going on over there? Not sure, Nat. Seems like the reactor's malfunctioning. I'm getting strange readings on the monitors. Like we're being pulled to a heat signal in the bay. Down! Repeat that, Cap. I'm having trouble hearing you. Nat, do you read? All hands. The Chimera is under attack. Evacuate the civilians. Are in the hole! Go! 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 I'll get to you as soon as I can. Have a look, shall we? Now that is an entrance. Taskmaster. Off, it could liquefy everything within a 10 mile radius. Well, what are we waiting for? Oh yeah? 
know, I was hoping to face you. Funny! I'm not giving you a second thought! left you. That you're not the brains behind this. And this smells like distraction. I'm done talking! Coward! What's the matter? Don't like surprises? Next time, take better notes. Guess you saw that coming, huh? You think you've won? What the hell are you talking about? Look around, Romanov. The world will remember this day. The day their heroes failed them. <laughs> What's happening here? The city's collapsing. Us. Steve, can you hear me? Get the hell out of there! Beta. Screw this. ago, the Avengers paraded dangerous, untested technology causing damage on an unprecedented scale. Our beloved Captain America was killed during the attempted theft of this technology. Thousands of other innocent people died, and many more still bear the scars of what has come to be known as A-Day. Hundreds fell sick, encased in strange cocoons, only to emerge with dangerous, otherworldly powers. With no known cure, the disease has spread across the country, and while both S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Avengers promised to rectify the situation, it was Dr. Banner's testimony that brought about the end of an era. You so-called heroes transformed San Francisco into an infectious, gas-filled quarantine zone. You unleashed disease, powerful beings that wreak havoc throughout our nation. Many still lay dormant, unidentified. So I ask you again, Dr. Banner, do the Avengers pose a danger to society? Yes. Their activities outlawed, the once mighty heroes disbanded. But out of tragedy is born hope. 
After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A-Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks science is the solution to our nation's problems. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day, but I was nowhere near the reactor room. I don't have those answers, but I can promise you this. I will use this second chance to make you safe. AIM will find a cure for the inhuman disease. Comforting words to those families torn apart by the disease. But is he too confident? Many criticize AIM's tactics. This so-called resistance army grows stronger every day. This is Phil Sheldon reporting live at the A-Day anniversary. Can't see the revolution right under their noses. Come on. Where'd you guys go? There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Hello there. If you get it right, copy everything. We'll find you. Now we're talking. Whoa, Retro Stark. Do you have a moment to talk, Beta? Uh, yeah, uh, sure. The girls are leaving for the mosque retreat in a couple of hours. It's still not too late to meet them at the bus. It was tonight? Kamala, we talked about this. Going to the retreat will be a good time to get away from all of this. Breathe some fresh air, laugh. Nakia will be very disappointed if you don't go. You're right. I'll think about it. Good. Very good. There'll be ice cream, eh? <laughs> oh, and best of all, no boys, so lots of fun. <laughs> I love you, Beta. I love you more. But you don't get it. <sighs> okay. Where were we? Password hint. First love. Hmm. Oh. Oh my god, I'm in! I'm in! I can't believe it! Oh, right. Uh, copy everything. Bless your inflated ego, Tony Stark. <laughs> I really kicked the hornet's nest. Gotta get to headquarters and check out what's on this flash drive.
leaps and does not score. Thanks for the lift. Who needs high-tech security when only I could make this jump? Ah, oh, back to the old HQ. It's a mess, but it's my mess. Looking pretty worn out. Wonder if they make any for super-sized punches. Ugh, a mare would reek at the sight of this. Well, then again, my brother freaks out over basically everything. Just let somebody try to get me at range. Stretchy arms for the win. Need my laptop. See what we've got. The Chimera. This must be the reactor room security footage. Dr. Tarleton. But you're supposed to be on the command deck. Oh, Cap. What's going on? No way. Tarleton sealed him in. There was no malfunction. He killed Cap. Oh my god, he killed Cap. What? Tiny Dancer? Oh no. Heroes Park? Hmm. Uh, I don't know. This could be a trap. But what if it isn't? Someone needs to see this. Just be smart, Kamala. Hand over the proof, and you're done.
First time heading to the park this way. Forward, I guess? Tarleton's lying about the command deck. Who knows what else he'd be lying about. Hello. What was I thinking? Not graceful. But made it. Okay. Get to the cap statue. Heroes Park. Been a while. My parents used to bring me here all the time when I was a kid. Everybody's a critic, slash vandal. All inhumans. All missing. This is what Abu's really worried about. The first person they called inhuman. It's really been four years. Should be a good place to stake out Cap's statue up ahead. Aim's tearing this place down to build their new clinic. Such a waste. Cap. It's been too long. Tiny dancer? Hey, hey. Where are you going? I'm not home. <laughs> really? We just got here. Hey, want a drink? Nah, no thanks. What? Are you paying your respects? I'm just taking a shortcut, that's all, fellas. <laughs> shortcut. Come on, get out of there. Right. Cool lighter. So you want him back, huh? So they can kill more of us? What? No. No? No? No. What is it then? Hmm? And you must get you going? What? Come on, fellas. Stupid stupid guys. Are you okay? Candle Kid's got a girlfriend. Zach, check out her bag. What? What the hell is wrong with you people? I just want to go home, okay, man? <gasps> what are you doing? My kid brother was there on A-Day. He wrote some dumb stuff about Captain America. It wasn't Cap's fault. It's all their fault. He turned all freakish and purple. And then they took him away! Hey, take it easy. Zach, enough, no, he's dude. Dead. Stop! He's dead! I said oh, stop! Dead. Get back. She's one of them! Oh. Don't let her touch you. We gotta go. Dude, are you okay? Come on, let's go. Don't touch me. What? You're a tiny dancer, right? What do I do with this? What are you talking about? Please, just let me go. Hey! Uh. Gotta move. If they catch me, it'll be my picture they're putting on that wall.
They're everywhere. She said. Stupid, stupid, stupid. This is not how I imagine this day ending. Fiend's <gasps> got humans looking for me too? Who can teleport? Still a liability. Oh, good. You're awake. I'm so sorry. Those synthoids were only following their security protocols. Stealing private information is a serious offense. Monica, give her a moment. Hey, what's going on? Where are you people taking me? Somewhere safe. Uh, forgive me. <laughs> I know I don't quite compare to my holographic counterpart. But it's a nice trick for the shareholders. <laughs> Dr. Tarleton? 
in the flesh. Why did you hack our servers? I didn't steal anything. And what were you looking for? The cure, perhaps? Kamala, AIM only wants to free us from being at the mercy of the powerful. You know, subjectivity. Unlimited power, that's dangerous. It's lethal. A-Day was a prime example. You are lucky to be alive. But with technology, we can right their wrongs. We can give you back your normal life. Look, I, I just guessed a password, okay? I, I didn't think I'd actually get in. She is clearly violent. Her infection must be getting worse. What? I, I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Of course not. But what happens when you lose control again? Hmm? What happens when you hurt someone that you love? Even the Avengers had to suffer for their hubris. Hey, were you there? I mean, when Cap died. Were you there? Yes. Luckily, Monica found me on the command deck. Her regenerative formula saved my life. Come on, Kamala. Let's do this. Yes? Let AIM help you. I'll take my chances. Damn it, George! Get the girl! Now! Well done, Kamala. You just outed yourself as an inhuman. Stupid! What were you thinking, huh? Join the resistance? Become some kind of hero? I can't go home. I'll make Abu. They'll punish them for hiding me. Really messed up. Utah. The old shield base. The resistance has to know what to do. Oh, crap! <laughs> Do this. Horsemen's in 
engaged. Why don't we give our new friend a hand? Jersey. Subject 1102 can clone herself almost perfectly, with the exception of a slight color variation in the eyes. The cells are splitting down the center, creating two separate individuals. Uh, it's, it's like the planarian flatworm, only human. Exactly and can retain all the memories of the original subject. 0925 can create powerful bursts of energy, and, and there's at least a half a dozen with fire-based abilities. We're building an arsenal. Programmable power under our control! No more heroes, no more mistakes. It's time for another dose. I feel fine. You were in a coma for six months. Earlier, you could barely contain your cough. A few more doses of my regenerative formula, and your treatment will be complete. They still light candles at the base of that statue. If not for that hammer, I'd have torn the thing down. Leave it. Why have the public thinking you're still worried about the Avengers? Let my people handle it. We have a Daptoid to launch. You're right. This version may be a bit more... potent. Is it stabilized? Almost. Incredible! You have reached Yusuf Khan. Please, leave a message and I will return your call. Hey, Abu. So, I took your advice. I'm with Nakia and the others on the retreat. Can you believe there's no cell service out here? I, I had to hike all the way up to this payphone to make this phone call. Anyway, um, you're right. We're having a blast. I'll, I'll be home late Sunday. I promise I'll be good. Love you more.
All the conspiracy theories online point to this canyon as a resistance home base. They're the only chance I've got. At least I know someone's in the body anyway. Just like me to travel across the country chasing rumors. Crazy rumors are all I got. Aim's out here too? I have to hurry. Finally! Something not made of rock. Is this a good sign or a bad one? Some must have escaped. They have to be around here somewhere. Better keep looking. Just need to get up high and see where I'm at. saw me out here. I mean, I'm freaking out. No way. Chimera. I found them. I can't believe I found them. <laughs> here we go. Three 
Chaperone. Up's probably the way to go. Holy crap, I must be close. Deck. Where is everyone? People were definitely sleeping in here. But how long ago? D uh. Hello? Kind of dusty. No. They're here somewhere. Maybe they hid in the crew quarters and got locked out thanks to the flaky power. Ugh, figures. Gotta get the power back on. Hmm. Maybe there's a breaker or something I could flip. Scared everyone away then. Sounds like this old thing's falling apart. What's that? Wow. Is that what I think it is? Terrigen was powerful stuff.
gotta get out of here. No wonder the resistance. Just one more thing to break. There's gotta be a way back up to the deck. Hulk should have transformed back to Dr. Banner by now. Guess I'm on my own. How could pushing a red button possibly go wrong? If Hulk comes back, I'm toast. This was the hangar bay. Almost there. Be cool, Kamala. Just need to get to the top deck without getting my head ripped off. Push buttons, move platforms. Right. Bam! I can get used to this. Just keep going up. Junction box. Okay. And voila! Oh, now that button has power, I can get out of here. There's my way out. No sign of the resistance anywhere. Hulk must have scared him away. Better find a way off this thing. <sighs> what am I supposed to do with this footage now? <gasps> Yeah. <laughs> 
to me. Oh, take it easy. It's okay. Just making sure that you don't die on me. Okay. You can't just go around drawing people's blood. I, I, I know, I know. Under normal circumstances, no. But these aren't normal circumstances. Holy crap. Dr. Banner? Oh, no. Um, Highway 9, Highway 9, it's about 20 miles. Highway 9, if you take Highway 9, you get rid of the stuff, then you probably could just do s what sorry. What are you talking about? I've spent a lot of time, um, as the, as the big guy, so. How long have you been here? Uh, a, a few years, yeah. Uh. That's remarkable. Yeah. So I've been told. So, this is why aimbots chase a kid into the desert? Not exactly. I kind of stole something off of AIM's server. Huh? <laughs> what? Why? Uh, Why? I know, I know, I know, okay? I just, I think you should see for yourself. It's Tarleton. Yeah. Why are you shutting down the security protocols? Did he just... Right? Right? That's what I thought. He totally locked the cap in the reactor room and then he tried to jack the chimera. That's a bit of a stretch. We know that the reactor was malfunctioning, so it's possible Cap asked him to shut down the security protocols and then lock the no, door. No, we've heard the A-Day testimony tons of times. Tarleton and Monica were on the command deck when the explosion happened, and that's why they barely survived. But this proves that Tarleton was nowhere near the command deck when the explosion happened. This proves he was lying. So, where's the rest of it? it? Got bumped off. The rest of the footage got corrupted. Yeah. Look. What if the Avengers were set up? Okay. Tarleton, AIM, the so-called cure, it's just not lining up. There's something wrong and I can feel it. Don't you? Here I thought you were just some nosy little thief trying to make off with Cap Shield. <laughs> so? I was thinking. Couldn't Mr. Stark help us with this? I mean, the whole mainframe was built on his technology. Um, if anyone could get us in, it could be him, right? Yeah. There is a bus stop off Highway 9. You're gonna keep heading west, and then when you do, it'll take you to some old friends who can help. Maria's good people. Tell her I sent you, and uh, just show her all of this. But you saw the video. You I'm know something's not right sorry. here. Sorry. I can't help you. I wish I could, but I can't. But you're Dr. Bruce Banner. You're one of the greatest minds of our time. Greatest minds? Look at you. Look at what we did. You have no idea how dangerous it is. Carlton calls people like me inhuman. He claims we're sick, violent, demented. He says 
says our disease will kill us in the end. Well, I don't believe it. Guess I'll find Mr. Stark myself. Wait. Just... You'll need a ride. Really? Tony stashed most of his stuff here when Stark Industries went under. And if anyone knows where Tony is, it's Jarvis. This trail should take us to the Archive's secret entrance. Cool. Well, it's a nice day for a hike. Yeah, that's the spirit. Yeah, are you wearing that communications bud I gave you? Yeah, practically invisible. So why did you go back to the Chimera? Well, I didn't. He did. So... Did he scare away the Resistance? You know, honestly, Kamala, I don't remember anyone being there. Now the big guy had a run-in with a few S.H.I.E.L.D. agents, but after that... Nothing. Oh. Right. I think I found something! Bit of tight squeeze. Yeah, watch your head. Here, let me help. Uh, thanks. Oh, okay. There's a clearing just ahead. The entrance should be there. Cool. So, what does Jarvis actually look like? Like an outdated hard drive from 1998. Okay, new question. What does a 1998 hard drive look like? Oh, God. Wow. Finally. This means we're close. Oh, wait. <clears throat> That's well, it's shut. Got it. Send in containment unit. Dr. Banner, what do I do? Run. What?
Hope you brought a change of clothes. Ooh, I can tell by your silence that you are not amused. It's okay. I don't think Bruce likes my jokes either. Bruce. Okay. Okay. I won't mention the, uh, the guy with the glasses. You're right. This doesn't look temporary. Hey. Uh, we good? Okay. We're cool. I guess. Oh man, King didn't just arrive. They've set up shop. We've got to find Jarvis and get out of here. Took over the place. Uh, still think Mr. Stark's here? I could head through the vents and take a look.
archive must be deeper inside the building. I'll keep looking.
too late. called a Terragenesis lab? What is this? You made it! They were keeping the inhumans in here. What happened? This is where they hurt them? Hulk, I need you to destroy this lab. Smash! Restrain the Hulk! You saw the truth, Banner. You were the only one. We're fixing the damage the Avengers did, what we did all those years ago. There is a chance for all those Inhumans to have a better life. We can still save the Inhumans from your fate. They want a cure. He's lying! He's not saving anyone! I wish you didn't have to come to this. I can see you fighting him. You don't want to be this thing. But you're weak. Both of you.
Guess I've got to keep flipping switches to get the power on. open now. Please be here, Jarvis. Maybe he's hiding somewhere in this super cool pile of Avenger stuff. I think this belonged to Thor. Maybe it's a secret lever? Oh, no, it's just a cup. Why display pyrite when you can afford the real thing? I should keep looking. The Mark One. Did he plan to come back for all this someday? Pepper to Tony. I know I shouldn't be freaking out right now, but I'm freaking out. Tony Stark's guitar! Cap's first shield. This was on display at A-Day. You don't open a secret passageway, do you? Worth a try. What's over here? Sharp guys.
Now to find Hulk and get out of here. What you got there, Cricket? Why don't you let me have that? I don't think so. Disappointing. All units, find the girl and stay out of my way. There's something wrong with you. Something different. Is it... dead? Hey, where are we anyway? Right, I'm talking to myself. Hey, 
705. According to our lead scientist, we have successfully reverse engineered Terrigen gas. What? Wait, please. Calm down. In a moment, this will all be over. Administer the cure. What, what does that mean? You're hurting him. result. Case 705 has made a remarkable recovery and will be monitored for the next 24 hours. Congratulations. You've been cured. Impossible. We should get out of here. It isn't safe. Yeah. Sure. Well, you can feel free to make it a little more homey. Oh, thanks. Yeah. You good? I'm not used to you being this quiet. Uh, uh yeah, it's nothing. Okay. Okay. Good. So, yeah. What if it's real? Oh, sorry, what was that? Uh, the cure. What if it's real? I mean... I mean, it looks real, but... Uh, what if I could be normal again? <laughs> it, uh... It didn't work like that. I mean, you saw them. It looks like it really hurts, but... But maybe that's worth it? Kamala... I never really fit in before. I mean, uh, superheroes were my world, and I figured if I could just... Uh, if I could just win that fan fiction competition, you know, then everything would just be... It doesn't matter. <laughs> now look at me. I'm a freak. Whoa, you're not a... <sighs> What you did back there... Hey. What you did back there took a lot of guts. S stupid. <laughs> but it still took guts. And... Not a lot of people could, you know, do that. Good isn't a thing you are. What? It, it's nothing. Um, thank you. This room is really great. Okay. <laughs> or it will be. I mean, okay. look at it. Yeah, <laughs> it's... Uh, uh, um... Good. Yeah, thanks. Okay, I'll go... do... other things. Good job, Kamala. That wasn't awkward at all. But now I have my own room on the Chimera. Is this really happening? I should go talk to Bruce. Or I could look around some more now that some of the doors are working. You know, give him some time to forget he saw me crying. Sorry about... 
Any luck with you know who? Uh, good timing. I was just about to take a look. Can I get a hand on the other side there? Just push that button. Okay, here goes nothing. Good afternoon, Dr. Banner. Oh. Whoa. We did it. Tony Stark's super awesome computer pal. Oh, I'm just a rather very intelligent system. A pleasure to meet you, miss. <laughs> Con. But you can call me Kamala. A pleasure, Miss Kamala. What's going on? The war table isn't getting enough power. The system is on emergency lockdown. Hmm. Looks like I tripped the security sensors when I was in the lab. We'll have to disable them. I got this. What am I looking for? All right, you're gonna use the console on the lab table to disable the sensors. Uh, I think I made it worse. It's okay. Just means you'll need to disable the security sensors manually. Uh, look for the little red lights. How the heck am I supposed to reach them? Really? Oh, right. <laughs> Duh, stretchy arms. Uh, got one. Okay. You know, in one of my stories, Iron Man has to shoot out a bunch of street lights to cover for Black Widow sneaking into a high school. Uh-huh. That's nice. Didn't think it could actually be a real thing an Avenger did, you know? I mean, uh, uh not that I'm a real Avenger or anything. Almost. All right, that did it. Woohoo! All right, come on back. Nice work, Kamala. Okay, Jarvis, let's find Tony. Uh, Jarvis? Searching now. Hold on, something... Something is wrong, Dr. Banner. That's not good. Oh dear. It appears my neural uplink was damaged when the Chimera crashed. It's highly specific shield technology. Without it, I can't access the global database. Shield? Uh, let's get Maria on the phone. Maria Hill? Is she leading S.H.I.E.L.D. now? Uh, sort of. No one knows what happened to Director Fury, so Hill is the only one I know I can trust. Bruce, it's, uh, it's good to see you. After my run-in with the Hulk, I wasn't sure we'd be hearing from you again. Yeah, sorry about all that. Uh, Hulk's been having some issues. You don't have to apologize. All our lives fell apart after that day. I'm just glad to see the Avengers back in action. Well, not... Quite. Hi, Kamal Khan. It's just the two of us for now. We're trying to find Mr. Stark. Yeah, uh, Marie, we're gonna need a neural uplink. You've gotta have one stored somewhere. All of our resources were seized by AIM, and most agents are still in hiding. But I may know where to look. I'm sending the coordinates to your war table. I can brief you on the way. Shall I prep the Quinjet's engine, sir? Uh, what Quinjet? Use the war table to set the Quinjet's destination of your next mission. The coordinates Commander Hill provided lead to an installation in a remote tundra region. I have marked the location on your war table. Missions that are critical to your investigation of AIM will be marked with the Avengers A. I thought that would be appropriate. Some missions will contain enemies with special abilities and modifiers. It would be wise to examine a mission's modifiers and plan your loadout accordingly. AIM forces in this region are reported to use cryotech weaponry. Equip any cold protection gear you may have to better your chances of success. Did you know this was here the entire time? <laughs> Absolutely not. I swear. Uh-huh. I think you just wanted to go on a road trip in your RV. <laughs> no. No. No.
Okay, Hulk, we've got to find that neural uplink. Maybe Mr. Stark can find us some more footage of what happened to Cap. At least I sure hope so. I'm giving you access to S.H.I.E.L.D. secure frequency. It should lead you to the bunker. Hang on. I'm getting some interference. Something down there is blocking the track. See if you can find out what. On it. Keep an eye on him, Capella. Aim hasn't found the but they can look very close to some that we need to. Commander Hill? Hello? Uh, radio's down. Guess it's just us from here. Not to worry. I will guide you to their signal jammers. Up there, it's an aim drop ship. Hulk smash aim. There is a special yes. enemy unit close to your location. Yes. They may drop something useful if defeated. That obstruction should be around here somewhere. Keep an eye out. <laughs> I heard that. Look for a chest containing special resources nearby. If you're curious, there should be an external locking mechanism you can use to open the door. Right, like a switch or something. You want to look around, Hulk? Chest with gear close by. You'll have to deal with whatever's disrupting the signal before you're able to track down that bunker. Sorry. Carry on. Shield signal is being blocked by a local aim security node. I'll need you to get me close to the so I can disable the destruction. Yeah. <laughs> 
working on clearing up the signal. Just stay within proximity of the security node. must be defeated. The signal should be coming through now. Loud and clear. The tracker will lead you to the shield bunker. Follow the beeps, got it. Still can reach Commander Hill, huh? I'm gonna try not to look that freak me out. Let's get out of the cold, Hulk. Uh, wait. You get cold? Data remains inconclusive. We're close. Do you see anything? No. I think we found it. Nice work. Let's hope that neural uplink is inside. We'll get you back to yourself in no time, Jarvis. I appreciate the sentiment. It is rather unpleasant existing without instantaneous access to all the information in the known universe. losing your memory? I'm not sure what the human equivalent would be. I suppose it's like being locked out of the library. Oh, like when Ami shuts off the Wi-Fi. Quite. Wow, take all this stuff. Guess we better start looking. Look for a chest with gear nearby. I believe we may have triggered a classified shield security system. Avenger detected. Hello, Avengers. It's been a while. Nick Fury. If you're hearing this, then the worst has happened. I'm gone. And that means I need you now more than ever. I always knew shield might fall. So I made sure it could also rise again. These are the S.H.I.E.L.D. protocols. S.H.I.E.L.D. was built to protect the world. In times like this, when it all seems hopeless, that's when we've got to stand strong. So I need a favor. 
Deliver these protocols to any remaining subdirector. They'll give Shield what they need to rebuild. Good luck, Avengers. Fury out. Director Fury. Like Shield's Director Fury. Those protocols he was talking about must be inside. Protect the uplink. I think I can upload the protocols to a secure server. We've got to get this data back to the Chimera. Think we can hold them off? Director Fury got more than we bargained for, didn't we, Jarvis? We'd better get this back to the Chimera. Charting a course now. Now that the neural uplink has been successfully installed, I can access my full database. Director Hill is reviewing the shield protocols that you also recovered. Feeling better, Jarvis? Everything seems to be in working order. You have no idea how much this means to me. To S.H.I.E.L.D. Thank you, Bruce. You too, Kamala. With this, I can start rebuilding S.H.I.E.L.D. in earnest. If you ever need anything, give me a call. I'm sure we'll be seeing a lot more of each other. Looking forward to it, Director. I feel like I should salute or something. No, no need for that. Good luck, both of you. Jarvis, you think you can get us Tony? This will take some time, but I should be able to find Mr. Stark. In the meantime, I've uncovered something that might be of interest to Ms. Khan in the harm room. The uh, what now? The holographic augmented reality machine. Something the Avengers use for training. Whoa, that sounds awesome. I should warn you, the system may be a little... Irregular. Is this safe? Only 0.0001% chance of injury. Uh... Okay. <laughs> I trust you. I guess. Proceed through the crew quarters. The harm room is on the lower floor of the hangar bay. 
Thanks, Jarvis. It's still hard to believe all this is real. I mean, I just flew on a Quinjet to a secret shield base. Uh, we saw Nick Fury, and, and now I'm talking to Jarvis and not keeping my cool at all. <laughs> Sorry. No need to apologize, Miss Khan. Uh, ready. Powering up. Whoa! Uh, what? Welcome to the holographic augmented reality machine. I'm Iron Man! Indeed. I've patched in Mr. Stark's old combat simulator. I hope you don't mind. Are you kidding? I am Iron Man! <laughs> Do your worst, virtual bad guys!
to start. Oh, uh, on my way. Mr. Stark's last known location is his ancestral home, Golden Acres. You may be able to find a clue to his current whereabouts there. Ever heard of it? He really does not want to be found. Indeed not. The estate was located in a remote area of Nevada. I can provide you with the precise coordinates. Dr. Banner, I have completed the scans you requested and have discovered residual traces of gamma radiation in a remote area of the Pacific Northwest. It is likely that Ms. Rappuccini is experimenting with your research there. I have marked the location on the war table. Check out the fancy drawbridge. Uh, typical. Subtle Tony. After you. I can't believe we're about to knock on Tony Stark's door. Me neither. Looks like the controls are on the other side. You think you can find a way over there? I mean, I could break through those rocks, but the green guy isn't the best. Good point. So, what's the best part of being the Hulk? You gotta like something. Uh, we should really focus on the drop bridge. What are you gonna do? Stand around in silence the whole time? Idea. Eh, suit yourself. More rocks? No problem. Uh oh. Are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. I can see Golden Acres. Uh, kinda. Great. Jump over and lower the bridge? Sure thing. You can make that jump. Just a little farther this time. Made it! Okay. Guess it needs power. Ta-da! I hereby grant you passage to Sir Stark's fancy castle. Okay, calm down. Nice job. Sounds like he's up, at least. Isn't that one of his top five songs to kick, uh, butt to? Yep. Good old number five. And hello, Golden Acres! Ugh. This can't be it. Let's get this over with. So Tony Stark, the Tony Stark lives here? I fear so. Tony? Hey, Bruce. Long night? Ooh, long five years. <laughs> um, at least it's quiet. Yeah. It was. I... Uh. Hey, back off! Hi, I'm sorry. Who are you? Uh, Kamala? Well, uh, Kamala, your Emeraldite friend here is kind of on my shit list. Okay. I deserve it. Yeah, you're damn right you deserved it. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. 
That was the question. Did you even check the science? Did you check it was a heist, science? Bruce. No. We were outsmarted. No. The Terrigen reactor was unstable, <sighs> and you knew that. You knew that, and you still paraded it before the entire world. So what? We just give up? We didn't give up, Tony. We failed. At least I can admit that. No. No, we failed him. We failed him. Tony, I don't know how long you're gonna be mad at me, and to be honest with you, I don't really care. Take as long as you want. But, but the kid is inhuman. We did this. And she needs your help. I, I can't, I can't. You can't what, you're ditching me? Hey, don't take it personally, kid. No, this is what he does, isn't it? And why don't you take a good look around, huh? I can barely help myself. <laughs> this was a mistake. Now we agree on something. So you're both just gonna walk away? The Avengers were set up. Cap was murdered. You think I don't know that? Huh? I've replayed that day in my head a thousand times. The Avengers take the ball despite saving the day, and that bastard Tarleton walks away smelling like a rose. And guess what? Guess what? No one cares. No one cares. The world needed someone to blame, and he gave them their scapegoat. So. Unless you have some kind of astounding proof. I suggest you both get off my land. What is that? Proof. This better be good. Hmm. Kind of buried the lead, you know. Could have told me about that earlier. No, no, no. No sitting on my couch. You're still on the list. Where did you get this? Guess your password on some resistance blog. Impressive. Dude, your password was I am Iron Man. Really? Huh. Thought I'd change that. Son of a bitch. I know, it's incomplete. There's a whole folder on AIM's server. No, no, there's there's more here. What? Yeah, look at smart. They encrypted it to look like a corrupt file. Need a few hours, I'll get all the rest. What is this? Who is who is Tiny Dancer? Oh no. We gotta get out of here. What? You know this shameless Elton John fan? They helped me get out of Jersey. I wouldn't be here if they hadn't warned me about AIM. Really? Tiny Dancer? Look, we really should go. Now. I would have gone with Rocket Man. Okay. I got to get dressed. You have a suit? Yeah. Maybe, sort of. We'll see. Excuse me while I slip into something less comfortable. Bruce tries to saddle me with a stray fangirl. No, oh, son of a... Well, it looks like Tiny Dancer was telling the truth.
great Nana's flying machine. Still a thing of beauty. I can't say the same about her. Let's get airborne. Party crashers. Oh, hey, fellas. Okay, it's got to be around here somewhere. Good thing I don't have neighbors. They'd be so pissed off right now. You always love to make an entrance, Stark. How did I do? Uh, I'll give you a 7 out of 10. Good to see you, Georgie boy. Been working out? Feel any other billion dollar companies lately? Just yours. Hey! You're gonna pay for that window, Tarleton! This is your new place? I expected more mirrors. I got rid of everything that didn't spark joy. Guess what pile you're in? Turn the girl over, Stark. And that will get you off my lawn. Uh, Mr. Stark. I'm joking, kid. Just stay near the nice green. The girl needs our help. Well, you know, she seems fine to me. Inhumans are sick. They need treatment. Ah! Ah, do people actually buy that crap? How's Charlton controlling these machines? I don't know. He got powers after the accident. I saw him controlling a robotic spider thing once. Well, he's leveled up from spiders. Get out, step, Mala. You have looked down on me from the moment we met. Let me introduce you to what I like to call Technokinesis. Catchy! Rolls right off the tongue! We got air trouble. Stay close to the Hulk. Or as close as he'll let you. No. I got this. Watch. Wait! You're not ready for... Or maybe you are. Frankly, I'm surprised to see you and Banner together again. Well, Brucey and I are seeing someone about our issues. She's great. Short, stretchy, really good at guessing past her. Still putting the weak in danger. You never learn. Oh, weak! Is that why you sent an army to take her down? Right? It's kind of a compliment, actually. I like you more every second, kid. Oh, you shouldn't have! Don't flatter yourself. I'm barely left to the finger. 
So the kid's right? You're mind-melding with robots now? You're choosing sides in a battle you don't fully understand. I chose my side five years ago. You showed up and forced my hand. Give me the girl, and you and Vander can do whatever you want. Forget it. Took the words right out of my mouth. Watch your words. You no longer make the rules. He does. When I was young, I found an orphaned wolf cub in the forest behind our farm. What? Dad said it was too dangerous. He told me to get rid of it. I fed that cub. I named him. I watched him play with my beloved dog, Darwin. You're wasting my time. I felt if I could instill rules, the proper boundaries, I could harness the raw power of that beast. Have you done rambling? Oh oh. A few months later, while hunting, the adolescent cub turned on me, snarling, frothing at the mouth. Darwin bought me a few precious moments to call for help. My dad shot the wolf. But it was too late. Darwin had been torn to pieces. George. We need him. <laughs> I I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. Leave. Please. Jarvis! You haven't aged a day. Welcome back, Mr. Stark. Missed you, buddy. You flying free? In full working order. Give me the worst of it. The Chimera is running on secondary power. Major hull damage is also detected. Engines are offline. Climate... So it's bad. That is an accurate assessment. Okay, we gotta get this bird airborne. <laughs> Excuse me? AIM knows it's here. So it needs to not be here when they get here. What? All right, while we work on cleanup, you mind taking a look at something for me? Certainly, sir. See what you can do about decrypting this file. At once. Gotta see why the turbines won't activate. Better check out the initiator cores in the hangar. Do I want to know what's going on here? Hey, Tony. Just lending my, um, technical knowledge to Bruce here. Bill Sheldon reporting live from some... Wait, wasn't this working before? Okay, Jarvis. Time me. 1.04 seconds, sir. Huh. Guess I'm a bit rusty. Jarvis, pop question, where do we keep the spark plugs? The initiator cores can be found in the far corner of the lower deck, sir. Correct, Amundo. Do I win a prize now, sir? You win the biggest prize of all, my affection. How exciting. Oh yeah, that looks perfectly up to safety standards. I think I've found the problem. I just... 
definitely the initiator course. Wait, don't the bigger aimbots use similar cores? If we could get a hold of one, I could get this old bird in the air in no time. Indeed, sir. But someone would need to procure said initiator cores. Yeah, I barely have a suit. Maybe I could cobble something together. I'll search inventory for leftover pieces of armor. Thanks, buddy. Hey, Tony, I'm still working on the door, but can you check on Kamala? I think she may have turned off her comms. Oh, okay. Sure. Yeah, this whole thing, it's uh, probably a tough adjustment. You got it. Second floor of the old crew quarters, right? Jarvis, can you see if she's even up there? Sir, there are no surveillance systems in the private quarters. Whose terrible hippie idea was that? Yours, sir. Right. Well, I guess I'm about to barge into a teenager's room. You. Whoa. Hey! Sorry? You should have knocked. I was trying. I was knocking fist. Jarvis, help me out here. It appears the locking mechanisms on some of the Chimera's crew quarters have not been enabled. There you have it. I will fix that. Please do. I'm gonna meet up on the command deck in about ten minutes. You should, uh, should come. I know, I... I look ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Of course you do. Man... No, 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 no. We all do. It's part of the job. Have you seen Thor's outfit? Flowing robe? Vegas shoulder pads? I mean, pretty ridiculous. <laughs> I am digging this, uh... Oh, it's a burkini. My mom bought it for me. Muslim ladies like to wear it for sports and stuff. It's great. Uh, all right, I'm just gonna change. Hey, wait, 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 wait. The outfit is is all about attitude. You gotta wear it like you mean it. Show me what you got. Come on, you can do better than that. Yeah, now we're talking. All right. You know what? Maybe I can help you with some upgrades for that. Gear's already spinning. Really? Yeah. Oh, and if Bruce says anything, just remind him that all he wears are super stretchy shorts. <laughs> Rose, the kid's fine. She's tough. Kind of like her. And she laughs at my jokes. Yeah, she, uh, she grows on you. Hey, uh, meet me at the tech lab. I've almost got this door fixed. Sir, in case you were wondering, your old room is still intact. You're still working on this door, huh? Well, I just need to remove the entire junction box and reconnect... Ah! Great job, buddy. See? Wasn't so hard. Home sweet home. All right, if we're gonna get anywhere, we'll need to establish an alternate power source. Chimera was built for Terrigen, but I can convert it to run on something a little less explodey. I'm scanning the region for sources, but it'll take some time to identify potential initiator core heat signatures. Well, in the meantime, I need a new suit. Where can I find parts to repair the fabrication unit? I've located a good salvage spot and have sent the coordinates to the war table. When you're ready. War table, got it. Fix the fabrication unit, get a shiny new suit, and get this bird off the ground.
right, first stop. No way I'm gonna be any help fixing up the Chimera without my own upgrade. Jarvis, what do you got for me? AIM is moving an experimental dropship, which could be appropriated for parts to repair the fabrication machine. Unfortunately, it's extremely well guarded. But AIM's local defenses are designed around a large-scale air assault. If I fly in alone, using the canyon for cover, I should be able to slip through and jack the dropship. It's risky, but I don't see an alternative at this point. I'll upload the dropship's last known location to your HUD. The canyon walls prevent me from fully confirming the intel. I suggest you work quickly. Well, I'm not exactly rocking a state-of-the-art suit, but it should get me there in one piece. Two, max. We need to move fast. Updating your HUD. Aim appears away. of our intrusion. How about we call this a surprise visit? Intrusion makes it sound like we're the bad guys. Noted, sir. Acquisition trip it is. I'm not sure how long our quarry will remain at a... How much firepower does AIM have down here? Rather a lot, it would seem. And how much was built with techniques from Stark Industries after A-Day? It's impossible to say at this stage. Possibly rather a lot. Karma is not my friend. It's interesting how many of AIM's systems look closely related to your design. George never was an original thinker. Makes them compatible though, which is handy. <laughs> Metaphorical clock is ticking, sir. I... The suit's doing great. Isn't calling it a suit rather generous? Ah, that's funny. Make the AI sassy, I said. It'll be fun, I said. goes to the landing pad we need. Gotcha. Look at all this. Which nation state is any plan to go to war with? Those munitions also appear similar to your design. Thanks, you guys. Don't want to blow them up. Fire! Let's get the dropship and get gone, before AIM brings the big guns, literally. I quite agree, sir. It's safe to say Dr. Tarleton would relish the chance to dance on your grave. Thanks, Jarvis. Now I'm stuck with a mental image of George doing the robot on my headstone. Apologies, sir. If I'm correct, the dropship should be just up ahead. Well, this place looks homey. Where the hell is my dropship? Scanning. The dropship was moved to a more secure location ahead. We can't get there before it takes off. We can if we overcharge the suit by 300% and take the direct route. Sir, you might literally explode. And that canyon is treacherous. 
Sure, but I feel the need for speed. Do it, Goose, and play something fast. suit won't last forever. This suit's all I've got left after George burned Golden Acres to the ground. I'm not losing. Gloves are making weird noises. Unsurprising. You just lost an acoustic dampening circuit. All systems are red. You know? Keep going, sir. Jarvis, this is my shot to make up for A-Day, help the kid, and, if I'm honest, stick it to Georgie Boy. You're damn right I'll keep going. Watch out. Their artillery's targeting you. Incoming. On it! The dropship shielded. Use all the juice left in the suit to get an EMP burst ready for me to trigger. Yes, sir. I've scanned the dropship and it contains the needed parts to repair the Chimera's fabrication machine. Excellent. Let's check in on the kids and head home. Bruce, Kamala, you read me? Loud and clear. Uh, Bruce is in the harm room pretending to be, uh... I don't even want to know. So, any luck out there? Success. We'll all be in new threads soon. The fabrication machine should be back online in no time. Great. Can't wait to make Bruce a new pair of yoga pants. Well, that was fun. I gotta say, it's nice to be back in the saddle. Yes, sir. You haven't missed a beat. Ah, glad to see that flattery upgrade kicked in. Now, let's take a peek at our loot. Ah, we hit the jackpot, buddy. This is exactly what I need to fix the fabrication machine. Glad to hear it. Especially as your current suit is now, how would you put it? Kaput. Hey, hey, did the job, right? I thought this tech looked familiar. These are all based on my designs. Some are near exact. They're sure taking advantage of the Stark tech acquisition. I'm kind of hoping they just sit on the assets. Is more like it. Don't it look amazing, Jarvis? Take my picture. Well done, sir. Finally feeling like my old self. Along with the fabrication machine, I've managed to route power to various other areas, including the inventory vault. I'm detecting some old equipment in your vault, sir. Should I incinerate it? What? No. That's not trash, Jarvis. It's my stuff. I'll go take a look. As you wish. trash. Indeed. I'm sure you'll use this to store many more treasures. Sir, representatives from our friends at S.H.I.E.L.D. are now aboard the Chimera. 
Agent Morales is in the command nest. We could really use your She help. may be able to help with the parts needed for the ship. Great. Look forward to meeting her. Hey there. I was told S.H.I.E.L.D. was in the house. I'm Agent Alessandra Morales. I'll be your point of contact for S.H.I.E.L.D. day to day. If you ever have any spare cycles, come see me. There's plenty that needs doing. Very nice to meet you, Morales. I need to find some parts to get this old girl in the air. Maybe I can kill two birds with one stone? Help out my old S.H.I.E.L.D. pals while I'm at it? We could really use your help. What do you say? Yes, you gave us an upper hand against AIM. Sir, a new S.H.I.E.L.D. representative has joined us and is now stationed in the Commons area. You ever want to try a new look? Now's the time. Too bad. Maybe next time? Agent Levine is on the hangar deck. If you have a moment, he can likely assist in further upgrades of your equipment. Next time, huh? Yep. Sir, my heat signature's scans have detected two potential sources of initiator cores. Potential? Why potential? Unfortunately, due to AIM security systems, determining the actual source of the heat signatures at this range is impossible. Uh, another word I don't like. Okay, then we double our chances. Bruce, Kamala, meet me at the war table. Way. Right, guys, we've got work to do. Hi, suit. Touche. How can we help? Jarvis has found a couple heat signatures that might be concentrations of initiator cores, but they're in completely separate locations. Since time is of the essence, we're going to need to hit both locations simultaneously. Bruce, you and Kamala need to search the outskirts of the Badlands while I investigate a city on the eastern seaboard. Hopefully, one of these spots yield us those initiator cores. You got it. Jarvis, how much longer? Approaching the location shortly, sir. Great. We've got to find those initiator cores and get back to fixing. It's only a matter of time before AIM pinpoints the Chimera's location, and we need our base of operations up and running. Oh, I look so good in this suit. Dashing, sir. You are right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where is everyone? Seems AIM has evacuated the city due to heavy inhuman activity. Sounds like an excuse to experiment on dangerous technology. Maybe your heat signature hunch was right. A giant stash of initiator cores could power their experiments. The facility is heavily guarded. Expect resistance upon your arrival. You mean they won't be happy to see me? Shocking. This place is a ghost town. Jarvis, how far is the facility? A few meters up ahead, sir. Hover scout platforms. Is there anything AIM didn't steal from me? Look for a chest with gear nearby. Get me in range of their pop-up access junction. 
position for long enough and I'll get us hit. Keep AIM's units out of range or the hack may be disrupted. Keep aim away. security systems, my improved readings of the heat signatures suggest that this may in fact be a much larger power source. So, not initiator course? It's difficult to say, but our detected intrusion has caused AIM to initiate a self-destruct sequence. And based on the size of the heat signature... Let me guess, it could level a few blocks? That is correct, sir. Well, AIM's not destroying another city on my watch. See what all the fuss is about, shall we? You can assume it will be well protected. No welcome banners. Got it. these doors. Ames willing to destroy everything to hide it. Oh no. Not good. Not good at all. This is my arc reactor technology, but supersized. This could lead to cities. What is Ames thinking? Oh. Hello there, handsome. Sir, the reactors are becoming increasingly unstable. You must shut it down. Taking out those amplifiers are the only way to shut it down.
completely destroyed the arc reactor. Well, that's not something I ever expected to hear you say. Let's salvage what we can and get out of here. Are you all right? Yeah. Yeah, just, you know, I made it for all the right reasons. That's what I told myself. But look at what happened. The Terrigen reactor, aiding. Now this... I can't control what other people do with my tech, but I can't pretend it's out of my hands anymore. I'm proud of you, sir. Yeah. I'm proud of me, too. Speaking of trouble, Bruce, Kamala, any luck with those initiator cores? Uh, working on it. Tony, we've been searching for hours, but there's one area I've been avoiding. We're just about there. It's a bit of a hotbed for AIM activity. I'm gonna have to bring out the big guy. Okay, kids, counting on you finding this second heat signature. Hopefully it yields us a bounty of initiator cores. It won't be long till AIM pinpoints the location of the Chimera, and without a base of operations, yeah, well, we won't have much of a chance. So, don't let me down. And good luck. Um, that's a lot of pressure. No, it's... Yeah, definitely. Okay. I can't let Mr. Stark down. Jarvis, where should I start? The second heat signature has a few scattered spots surrounding a rather large center, suggesting a significant concentration of potential initiator cores. It must be stored in a single location. A structure, perhaps. Got it. Uh... Jarvis? Yes, Miss Khan. Is it me, or is the Hulk not his bright green self? It appears Dr. Banner has been struggling with the passing of our beloved captain, Miss Khan. From his recorded memos, he returned to Chimera determined to solve the events of A-Day, but instead grew more frustrated with his perceived failings. Oh, of course. Bruce feels guilty. It seems they all do, Miss Khan. Shock my suit. Got eyes on anything? All clear here! They burnt out the core! They're trying to destroy as many as possible. Then we must hurry. Target spotted! That's the Hulk! We need backup out here! these guys. They aren't the normal AIM tin cans. Miss Khan, I believe they may be part of a group who call themselves Watchdog, a radical anti-superhero organization. <laughs>
We have scavenged every part of this desert by now. And it's not gonna be enough. <sighs> Am I alone? What? Where are all the other Inhumans? Why aren't they fighting back? I... I... I've seen the Resistance symbols. I've heard rumors of a rebellion, but still nothing? I don't feel sick at all. I've never felt more alive. What if I'm wrong? I know what that feels like. These powers are a part of us. And all I do know, it's a lot better if you just embrace that. Or something like that. My dad used to say the same thing. Well, he's a smart guy. <laughs> the best. You should head back to the Chimera. Okay. Stay where you are! Come on, man. A uh, kid and an old guy. Old guy. Alright. Dr. Pym will see you now. Do H Hank Pym? Hank? Bruce? What are you doing out here? I could ask you the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Good to see you, man. Good to see you. Uh, Kamala, this is Dr. Hank Pym. Ant-Man? That was, uh, another life. Follow me. Okay, so this is the heat signature we've been searching for. We have been salvaging weapons, robots, aim tech, anything we can to build up our defenses. Think you could spare some of these initiator cores? You know, help out a helicarrier in need of some TLC? I imagine we can make some arrangements. Thank you very much. What <laughs> is this place? We call it the Ant Hill. Oh. Not my idea. I think it was one of our anonymous hackers, Tiny Dancer. <sighs> no way. So, so they're all... Inhumans, yes. Many of them were prisoners at a name facility. I guess they were fighting back after all. Make yourself at home. We've got lots of ketchup on. This place is more than I ever imagined. Oh, hey, Banners buddy. You got a sec? You're the portal guy. That would be me. Theo the portal guy at your service. I'm Kamala. Your powers are awesome. Oh, thanks, but you should talk to Sarah. She's up ahead next to the big surveillance screen and is dying to meet you. Me? Okay. Welcome to the Ant Hill. A little home of the You got a sec? Hi, you're Pim's desert crawling friend. Did Ames send you here to spy on us? What? No. I'm kidding. I've got cameras in a bunch of those dead mechs you passed in the desert. It was pretty fun watching you kick watchdog butt. Oh, thanks. I'm Sarah Garza, and the whispers about you are already fierce. Good whispers? Hell yeah. We want you on our team. You ever have spare cycles? I've got plenty that needs doing. Could really use an Avenger on this one, you know? You are a lifesaver. Could you check out that chest behind you? Just got a fancy new shipment in and haven't had time to ogle it yet. 
Sure thing. I don't know what this is, but I bet Sarah will be excited about it. Hey, Avenger! Uh, need some help over here. Ah, uh, exactly what the doctor ordered. Thanks a bunch. No problem. Happy to help. Want to know a secret? The robots around here are all Pym's pet projects. We've got the first Mark I hanging out in the gear shack next to the stairs. Literally. He's hard to miss. Okay. I need some help over Guess here. Guess I can go take a look. Welcome. Greetings, first time customer. Do you require my services? Uh, sorry, sorry, I I'm staring. Sorry. I have no feelings regarding your ocular direction. Every trace of my past has been erased for security purposes. Oh, that's kind of... sad. My programming deemed it inefficient to be attached to such redundancies. I only receive joy through mutual transaction. So, the more I buy, the happier you get? Correct. Welcome. What is mine is now yours. Excellent selection. Thank you. That is perfect. Psst. Don't freak out, but Dr. Maddie Cho wants to see you in her office. Oh, what? Dr. Maddie Cho is me. Drop by the lab. I'll hook you up with some goodies. Dang, look at you. I am liking the whole vibe. I'm Maddie, resident bio genius. Don't tell Pim I said that. Or Banner. Secret safe with me. You called me to your office? Yes, though I am not an inhuman, I am a purveyor of goodies, gear, and gadgets. If you need anything to make you faster, stronger, or stretchier, I'm your gal. What do you get out of it? Being smarter than everybody else. Bring me the right materials, and I'll build you gear to make AIM weep. I've already got some prototypes. Take a look. Sweet. What's up? I'm in awe. Uh, I might be drooling. Can I help you with any of this stuff? Not right this minute. But you could help Pimsy with a little zinger. Check out the war table. He'll fill you in. War table it is. I'll just be here if you change your mind. I think it's time to show AIM what I can really do. What do you think, Jarvis? I think you can I accomplish think... anything you set your mind to, Miss Khan. Okay, now that we've got some muscle on our side, I think we should hit one of AIM's testing labs. We know they've been experimenting on inhumans in small rural communities. I'd like to get my hands on whatever research they've been collecting. Sounds good. We crashed one of their big labs in the Pacific Northwest. Olympia Archive? Impressive. We wondered who was responsible for taking that place down. Thanks. We didn't get out with a lot of information, but now maybe we can find out more.
AIM has been setting up bases in small towns throughout the rural west. We suspect they've been using these as testing labs and capturing the local inhuman populace for their experiments. I can't believe all this has been happening right under the government's nose. Well, they have a lot of power in Washington and financial connections to every major corporation. AIM has had five years to set down their roots. Taking them down is not gonna be easy. Well, we gotta start somewhere. It's up to us to do the right thing. <laughs> Spoken like another Avenger I once knew. Welcome to Venture Ridge, Wyoming. This was one of AIM's go-to holding sites for Inhumans before the prison was built. After they moved in, most of the residents were evacuated. Got it. Keep an eye out for AIM patrols. They won't take kindly to your presence. With any luck, we'll be able to capture intel that could shed some light on what they've been doing to your people. I've marked the facility on your HUD. Thank you for doing this. At least I can do. You guys kept me going when things seemed hopeless. Knowing the resistance was out there meant we had a chance. The odds finally seem to be tipping in our favor. Good. Someone to hit. One of our resistance allies is close by and could use some help. Watch her back. Do you think we'll find something to prove AIM is hurting in humans? AIM keeps their data well guarded. We haven't been able to get anything solid. We just have the word of the inhumans. And I'm afraid that's not enough. Look for a chest with gear nearby. Initiated emergency procedures. Do your words, please. Bye bye. Flanking positions.
So you were a prisoner too? Why'd they capture you if you aren't inhuman? According to Tarleton, anyone with powers is a threat. They made sure I'll never use mine again. Altered my physiology so if I change size, I'll die. I'm so sorry. Where to? Records show a secure lab at the end of this hallway. There's a chest with gear close by. Don't worry! An AIM equipment storage cache is nearby. It might be worth exploring. You sure this is the right place? I've nearly breached AIM's network. They're hiding something. Stand by and see to the AIM forces. Oh, they'll get seen to. Please work fast, Jarvis. As fast as my processor allows, sir. Uh. ship is preparing for takeoff. Whatever's on that transport, I want it captured. Get to it before it leaves. Thing taking off. I don't know if we can, but I could attempt to divert the transport from its intended destination. Excellent idea. See if you can reprogram its destination to the anthill. Looks like we made it just in time. Get close to those terminals so I can infiltrate their network. We must control all three to override the transport's navigation system. Be on guard. AIM will try to regain control of the terminal.
control. An aim unit took back control of an access point. Jarvis, tell me you got it. Yes, sir. In point four seconds to spare. The transport should be arriving at the anthill within the hour. Excellent work, everyone. Head back here and we'll begin digging through those AIM research samples. Well, that didn't go quite according to plan. We've got some valuable research samples, but AIM is far more powerful than I had anticipated. And they've got so many of my people. We have to stop them. Agreed, Kamala, but we need some time to regroup. When Tony gets here with the Chimera, we'll be in a much better position to go on the offensive. Okay, but we can't wait too much longer. Okay, head back to the Ant Hill and we'll talk about next steps. Um, it's Mads. Can you swing by the lab real quick? Sure. Uh, be there in a sec. Hello? What's going on? I heard what happened with the dropship. They just wanted to give you something. Hello there. I'll just be here if you change your mind. Uh, that does not sound good. Thanks for you, Ray. This chassis was created solely to aid in Fire powers? That's intense. I mean, they look awesome. Um, I'm a polymorph, I think. It's cool, it's like, like stretchy arms and stuff. Uh, still working on making it not look goofy, but... You're inhuman. Yeah. So what's your name? Dante. Kamala. Hey, what happened? I broke my leg during the escape. Well, at least you made it out, right? My mom came back for me. Yeah, I made it out. And she was captured. Well... The Avengers are on the way here in a couple days, okay? They're gonna take back the prison and your mom's gonna be fine, believe A couple believe days? Me. Why isn't anyone listening to me? I overheard Dr. Pym. They're moving all the prisoners to a new location. Well, uh, they'll find that too. Oh, no, they won't. Your Avengers will be too late. Here, let me help uh, you. No. Don't you get it? We're inhuman. No one cares about us. That's not true. I've got to tell Bruce. We could do something. I've got to convince Bruce and Dr. Pym to go back to the prison. Roy, I need you to send one of your disposable chassis to the Camaro with a few supplies. And Roy, stealth will be key. Right away, Doctor. I'm gonna say it, it's, it's just genius. 
Hey, got a sec? Yeah, 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 what's up? Aim's moving the Inhumans to a more secure location. Soon. Okay. You've been talking to Dante? Uh, I'm sorry, who, who's Dante? One of our Inhuman survivors. We were able to get him out, but his mother is still inside. And our escape caused AIM to shore up security. Gotcha. Look, we have to help them. Mm, that's not a good idea. What? There's inhumans in there. I don't understand. Dante's we, mom. We I can't just know, sit around and I do guess. nothing. We're not going to sit around and do nothing, okay? Roy just left with the energy cores. It means Tony's going to be here in less than a day. We need to wait. I don't understand. We have the Hulk. Mama. The Resistance has been trying to infiltrate that facility for months. Getting out was far easier than getting in, and we, we had help. From the ground, its walls are nearly impenetrable. You saw what we did back there. I could help. But it's too risky. You want to help? You don't There's understand. You're not inhuman. You're not ready. I'm sorry. We wait. Sorry, I can't just... I can't do nothing. Come on, Lacan. Ah! You are not asleep. True. I see. I shall inform Dr. Pym. Uh... Could you not? All right. Good evening. You're Roy, right? Correct. This refurbished resistance unit falls under my control. It is one of many. So you're kind of like Jarvis. No, not like Jarvis. My neural network is infantile in comparison. One day, perhaps. Would you care to socialize? It is a beautiful night, is it not? Theo is on shift. Uh, thanks. Hey, Kamala. You still up this late? Yeah, I... was going to lie, but I'm going to the prison. They wouldn't be moving those prisoners if it wasn't for us. Respect. Right this way. Really? Just like that? I've got a good feeling about you. But you're gonna need this. It's not safe out there. Thanks, Theo. Those inhumans need our help. If this works, then all's forgiven. I hope. I'll be back before Bruce even knows I was gone. to me. Just get these open, and I'm in. Can we just pretend you never saw me? Come <laughs> on. 
one's my favorite. terms of our agreement were clear. We deliver a cure. You control the media. And we've more than held up our end, but this cure of yours? Children being ripped away from their families? People missing? <laughs> Even my resources have their limits. The public needs answers. I'm giving you something better. The launch of the Adaptoids will be the perfect distraction. <clears throat> and after? Without proof that your cure works, words like terrorism are being bandied about in some of my circles. Oh, it will work, Senator. I have the utmost confidence in Dr. Rappuccini's abilities. How much of that was a lie? The effect of the gas is still only temporary. And without my formula to keep them alive, well, the gas... Kills them. This isn't working! That gas gave us the Adaptoid. My formula kept you alive. Now if I could isolate how it manifests within the Inhumans, I know I can reverse the effects. There are more opportunities here! We have enough powers harvested to build your army. It's time we cut our losses. Shut it down. This maintenance system should need to Monica's lab. 
Odds are good, come on. Oh, hi. Hold the door. Fine. They still haven't replaced the admin codes I installed last year. Sloppy. Oh, door number two it is then. Adaptoids. I've only seen these things on paper. Carlton's making an army in here. The lab's priority one. Damn it! Be the girl, Monica. Gotta get in there. They're clearing out the building. Hoping for more of a fight. Gotta hack the controls. Knock knock. Anyone home? <laughs> nice digs. Now we know who's really running the show. Years of undercover work, and a kid from Jersey City brings me right to the heart of AIM's operation. <laughs> now there's a door that screams evil supervillain lab. Monica's lab, all right. Let's find out where they've got the girl. What the hell are you thinking, kid? We should have stayed put. Of course. Okay. Where are you? Dark Jerichen. None of your so called cures ever work, Monica. You're provoking her powers. It's killing her. You're not even looking for a cure anymore. The formula keeps inhumans alive just long enough to copy their powers. It's just a cover for your twisted experiments. Stealing powers to create adaptoids. I have to find Kamala. All right. You look I don't suppose we can talk this out. Join your friends. I can't tell you how many times I've to punch your smug artificial faces. So much more satisfying.
contamination protocols. Great. I need to stop this gas. It's working. Let the gas out of control. I'm gonna find a girl. Kamala would be in the main salt block. They're transferring the Inhumans. Hope I'm not too late. Hiding behind that won't help. prison break. They must have moved most of them. Be here, Kamala, please. do this all day. Hoping I'd meet you.
finally let loose on these same bastards. Anyone want to I do love it. Gotta unlock the door. Terrace leads to the inhuman holding cells. Gotcha. Tiny dancer doesn't have as much bite as Black Widow, does it? Took you long enough to figure it out. I thought you were the brains behind this operation. I am. It's nice to be appreciated. So if you're running the show, what's the end game? That may have worked with Taskmaster, but I'm not stupid enough to fill up legs for you, Romanov. Okay, let me take a step. You and George are using Inhumans for your adaptions. That regenerative formula keeps them alive just long enough to get a part of That's a part of it. But I have grander aspirations. You're facing the Avengers. Not everything is about you. Shut it off. Monica, nice suit. You've caused me enough. 
problems. And I'm not done yet. Where's the girl, Monica? Huh. Oh, not so easy as that. Where are you taking the inhuman? Somewhere safe. You can have all my toys. Of course, people are toys to you. No, not toys. Noble sacrifices to the greater good. Mock me, but everything I've done has been for the future of humankind. Your prisoners are human too, Monica. Collateral damage is inevitable. You should know this better than most. I've heard that argument. Always ends with people dying. Done everything with you. What's that supposed to mean? I haven't forgotten a day. Keeping people in cages, I'm not going in. like to know. Damn it. You won't get off that easy. I've got a special guest here. Binder. She's coming with us. Anybody need a lift? Have you seen a teenage girl? Brown hair about yay high? Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, in the in the cells. Um, she wouldn't come with us though. Okay, just go. Kamala. Black Widow? What what are you doing? Come on. Let's get out of here. Uh I'm going home. Uh, to Jersey. Um, I don't know who I was kidding. I'm no hero. I don't know. I got a quinjet full of people who would disagree with you. I couldn't control it. I. I keep passing out. I. I blew it. Hey. Mistakes are gonna happen. 
To be honest, Jersey wasn't my finest hour either. Tiny Dancer. Look, kid. You're already a hero. The only one left to convince is yourself. Come on. Let's get the hell out of here. Are you okay? I'm sorry. I must have. Mm. It's okay. Why don't you, uh, why don't you get inside? Tiny dancer. It's good to see you too, Bruce. So, how'd you like that daring rescue in the nick of time? You fishing for a compliment, Tony? Meet me on the command deck, all right? We have a short window to make our next move while AIM's still on the back foot. Right, right. Pleasantries later. Got it. All right. Gotta head to the command deck. Okay, Tony. We need to show the world what AIM's been up to. And I've got the perfect opportunity. The AIM experience in Manhattan. The media launch for Tarleton's new adaptoids. Every network will be there. I think it would be a perfect place for a few dozen missing inhumans to suddenly reappear. We have to be careful, though. AIM will bury the truth and kill any remaining prisoners rather than risk exposure. We'll need the location of their lab so we can lock it down. Good thing you captured Tarleton's second-in-command. If someone can get her to slip, it'll be Bruce. He's already volunteered. Not bad, Tony. Head on down to the interrogation room. I'll let Bruce know he's on deck. Miss Romanoff, Dr. Pym would like a word with you at the war table at your earliest convenience. Greetings from the anthill. Natasha, thanks for helping save the day back at Ames Prison and for everything you did as Tiny Dancer. I wonder who our mysterious guardian angel was? Anytime, Hank. Sometimes dirty hands do the best work. True. And how the hell did you folks get the Chimera online, let alone airborne without Terrigen? The Chimera has the same standard engines as older helicarriers. She's kind of like a hybrid car. But, you know, cool. Something tells me this isn't just a thank you call, Doctor. Guilty as charged. We did a little digging in the data you sent me from the prison. AIM was able to successfully transport most of the Inhumans. I've tracked the ship, but we'll need someone to go in after it. We'll do whatever we can. Thanks. I've already uploaded some mission details to your war table. Pam out. Miss Romanov, welcome back to the Chimera. I have intel on the potential AIM defectors that you transmitted to me during your time as Tiny Dancer. I've marked a location on the war table that should be of interest to you. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to have you handling mission details for me again. Just like old times, as they say. Copy. Data added to the war table. We'll send help as soon as we can. Enjoying the view? Not enough to distract me from what's waiting downstairs. But I think I'm ready. I guess I have to be. Okay. I'm gonna go prep the interrogation room for you. If you want to chat, I'm just a radio call away. Thanks, Nat. I just need to, you know, ponder some things for a bit. Yeah, well, don't ponder too much. Chimera system check. How we doing? Oh, hey, Nat. Since Roy brought up all the power cores needed for the Chimera, I figured he could stay up there and help outfit you all as needed. We can repurpose another aimbot to take his place here at the anthill. Nat, um, I'm about to talk to Monica. 
She's gonna try to manipulate you. You know that, right? I think I know Monica well. No, you don't. There are a thousand Monicas. She switches them like masks when she needs to. Yeah. Look, all I'm saying is if you go in there with expectations, she's gonna blindside you. Are all exits secure? Yes, Agent Romanoff. Good. Open the airlock for me, and don't open it for anyone else but Dr. Banner. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Initiating airlock override protocol. You've worked with Monica for a long time. She's changed, hasn't she? No, you see, I don't honestly believe she ever had any true feelings for you. But if I'm wrong, if she betrays any real emotions, exploit them. That's your leverage. <laughs> Always appreciated your brutal honesty, Nat. You can do this, Bruce. More importantly, you have to. We need to find the rest of those inhuman prisoners before we crash the party at the AIM experience. Okay, we ready to do this? Oh, this should be interesting. These two haven't spoken since the hearings. Think Bruce is up to it? He better be. Once we break up Tarleton's little party, he'll clean house. The AIM experience. So many better names. Look, we need the location of that lab. Hundreds of inhumans depend on it. So tiny dancer, huh? Let me guess, you would have gone with Rocket Man. Please, not even close. You're my candle in the wind. Show's about to start. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. The triumphant return of the Avengers. Imprisonment and torture. That's how AIM's gonna make the world a better place? Please. Ebola, smallpox, Polio, all fatal, if not for lab rats. And humans aren't sick, Monica. You're just harvesting their powers to make your little robots. <laughs> robots that possess complex AI. Capable of assessing the most effective application of their powers, all with minimal human casualty. Where's the lab, Monica? You can reverse engineer Terrigen, sure, but it'll be catastrophic and you know it. You were there on A-Day, and you know if we do it again, it's not gonna just endanger in humans, it's gonna endanger all of us. Last I checked, A-Day was your mess. Uh, damn it. Gonna need a stronger table. I see some things haven't changed. Everything's just an experiment with you, isn't it? It is. Tarleton and humans. Me. the Earth, you will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! I'm going in. We need to find that lab. Jarvis? Sensors detect aim forces incoming. Tarleton's come for his sidekick. Nat, Quinjet. You read my mind. Stay with me. All right. Hey, uh, just... Watch yourself out there. I will if you will. Mala, let's go. 
We can't let AIM stop us from getting these Inhumans in front of the press. My guess? Georgie boy's on to us. They seem even secure. Miss Refugee. Jarvis, keep an eye on our guest. Jarvis, He's the sure. Jarvis, can you open this one? Sorry, sir. AIM is locking me out. Yes, we do this the old way. Well, this just escalated. Tell you what, you survived this. Maybe it can work for me. That would be awesome. Great. Focus on the angry robots. I'll bring down the flying hunter metal. With pleasure. Bruce, how we doing on getting pissed off? Jarvis isn't home anymore, Kamala. This ends now! Guys, I got a problem here. Guys! I've made sure your new friends won't know until it's too late. You still gotta go through me! You should have accepted my offer. Didn't end up like all those other inhumans. Yeah, no. Why don't you just take Monica and go? Why all this? 
find out. The Avengers are using you, Kamala. Don't bother with the BS, dude. It's not gonna work. You're so naive. Shut up! Your new friends will let you down. That's all they know. Unlike you, I have faith in Bruce and the others. Well, so did I. Once. The world's about to be reminded who the Avengers really are. What are you talking about? has escaped. In trouble, Kamala! I need you on the deck now! I'm coming! Monica, she's escaping. We're here live at the AIM Experience in Manhattan, witnessing the return of the Avengers, but they... They appear to be attacking the city! Keep rolling! Keep rolling! Is it any coincidence that this attack comes on the very day that AIM is supposed to unveil their promising new adaptoid program? Oh, shit. supposed to do Thor. You gave up your power. You should have stayed forgotten. Never with more than current. Where do you hide, Doctor? Can you not face me? Look around. I'm everywhere. Come 
in America for? Who else will fall before your hammer? Completely lost your senses. Ah, the prodigal son returned. You almost obliterated all of Manhattan. Well, holier than thou, where were you while the world went to hell? Coming to terms with my failings, not making new. Ones. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everyone, just take a breath. We planned on interrupting the AIM experience, showing the world what Tarleton was up to. These adaptoids of his, they harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. They expose them to near lethal amounts of dark terrigen. And that is only step one. Georgie Boy is gearing up for a war. 
And what's worse is Kamala here has found some evidence that might show what really happened to Steve. Hi. Every hero has to start somewhere. You remember me? Aye. Show me this footage. Jarvis? Are you done? I've broken the encryption, so there is more to see. George! We have to shut down the reactor! It's pulling us towards that heat signature. Uh, I've tried, but there's no way to disengage the crystal. Then get out and seal the door. What? George, go. No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck. What? Evacuate now. No, 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 Cap. What are you doing? No, 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 no. Just stop. What? Smash the reactor. He had to have a reason. What reason? Hundreds of people were infected. People died, Nat. Just take it easy. Did you take some responsibility, Tony? Well, there's the Bruce I know. Throw everyone under the bus, why don't you? No, it's not the time. No, it's okay, Nat. See, he's been waiting to do this since Golden Acres, haven't you? Haven't you? This is our fault. All of ours. How do you not get that? It, what I get is that you actually believe all that crap you said at the hearing. I believe that we are dangerous. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. I'm out of here. You all have not changed. Look at her. She can't be fixed. She can't be cured. I've done the experiments. I've checked our DNA over and over and over again. You and I created the perfect disease. No, actually, I do the job. I make the tough decisions. Do it. I stand by the people who made me who I am. I am warning you. <laughs> Bruce? Make you angry? <laughs> See, it's always been your problem. Run from who you are, what you are. Maybe that's why. Monica got the better of you. I was just agreeing with you, big guy. That banner is a coward. Guys, don't do this. This is exactly what Tarleton wants. I'd stay out of this one, kid. keep this thing in the air? For quite some time, yes. Oh, that's a relief. Without proof, there's no hope. But I can't just give up. This can't be how it ends. Bill Shelton, live on the scene here in Manhattan. Jarvis, is there a recording of Bruce's interrogation of Monica? Certainly, miss. You can access it in the interrogation antechamber. If I may be so bold, Miss Khan, what do you hope to find in the interrogation footage? I don't know. I have to try something. Maybe she slipped up. Interrogation footage. There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. Come on, Monica, give me something. Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the 
the world requires sacrifice! Ugh, this is useless. I just want to talk to my dad. Calling Yusuf Khan. No, no, don't, Jarvis. I didn't mean to... Hello? Beta, is that you? Oh, oh come on. Uh, if you're there, I miss you so much. Look, I'm not angry. I just want you to come home. I'm sorry. I should never have told you to hide your powers. Perhaps you're scared. A little unsure. I... The important thing is that you always stay true to yourself. I love you, Beta. I love you more. Avengers, if you can hear me, I think I found a clue. Look, I know I messed up. I wanted to blame AIM so bad for what happened to me on A-Day, it blinded me. But Cap must have had a good reason for what he did. I, I know it. People believe in the Avengers, not just because of your cool powers, but, but because no matter how bad things get, no matter how much you disagree, you always come together. Don't you get it? Your differences are your greatest superpower. I was just some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. But you saw me for who I really was. You accepted me. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. But we can stop him. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. I shouldn't have said. I get it. Altitude, dry eyes. Look, I'm uh, not very good at. I'm sorry. So, same. Good enough. Yep. So, you, uh, Found a clue? Yeah, it's the interview. Listen. Scour the earth. You will not find our lab. Okay. Monica's right. The lab's not on Earth. I'm not following. Okay, when I was captured, Monica and Tarleton had this argument. Tarleton had to leave the room, 
And then Monica pulled up the coordinates to this satellite called Ambrosia. Ambrosia? That was a S.H.I.E.L.D. biomedical research project. AIM must have required it during the takeover. It would be a great place to hide proof of inhuman experiments, right? If you wanted to study in humans on the cellular level, then zero gravity would be a perfect place to do it. Good job. Okay, so we know where we need to go. We just need a way to get there. Project Starboost, sir. As I recall, you abandoned it because you couldn't generate enough acceleration in the auxiliary rockets. Yeah, yeah, no need to bore everyone with the details. That was before I had access to Mr. Shrinky. Jarvis, get Pim on the phone. We need a way to get up to this space lab. He's the only one who can help. Hey, Tony. Please tell me this is a social call. Yeah, it is. Uh, I'd like to socialize with a few of your PIM particles. Need to shrink down an accelerator. <sighs> well, then you'll need to break into a high-security aim facility. Ever heard of Meridian? You're gonna have a hard time getting in. That place is no joke. Widow? I gotta say, you give a hell of a speech when you're pissed at us. <sighs> Look, Nat, uh, we were idiots. I'm... As much as I love your squirming, it sounds like we've got work to do. I can get us to Meridian. Us? We're in this together, right? No time to lose. AIM confiscated all my research when I was captured. They haven't figured out how to use the particles, but they'll be well protected. Okay, there aren't a lot of ways into Meridian. I think our best bet will be to hijack one of their hyper-circuit trains and take it directly to the heart of the operation. I, I can hack the trains, but it'll leave the anthill exposed. AIM will be able to pinpoint our location. You'll need to hurry. So we go in loud and smash the base up. Good, I prefer the direct approach. In all my time undercover inside AIM, I never could get the clearance to see Meridian. Well, Nat, you're about to get your chance. Uploading the coordinates to the hypercircuit station entrance. Let's move out. So, how many super secret research bases does AIM have? Too many. But Meridian is as much. You nervous about using Pim's particle tech on your suit? Hank's smart, but his Pim particles are unstable on their best day. If he can get it working, it might be just what we need. So, let's say, hoping for a miracle. You know I can still hear you, right? Ah, oh, crap, Nat. We did it again. Sorry. Changing channels. There's the hypercircuit station. It's protected by a force field. Destroy the field's power source, and I'll hack into their system to call a train. Understood. Oh, crap. That's not good. I don't like the sound of that. 
running into some serious firewalls here. I need more time. On it. Just get us that train. <laughs> Place is on alert now. Still deal. Choo choo! All aboard! Really, Tony? near the anthill. We need that particle sample ASAP. We may be out of time, Hank. Not yet. We're almost there. Let's get what we came for. Look for a chest with gear nearby. One of my operatives through to your location. He'll teleport you and the particle sample back to the anthill. Teleport! Oh, this should be interesting. Please hurry before they reach us.
could have handled that. Next time I might just take a nap. Looks Enemy like we're clear. Spotted. He should be there. Avengers, hurry! Where's the pin particle? Get us back to the ant hill now. They need our help. You won't even on the front lines. Hold tight. This might be a rough ride. Thank you. I'll deliver the particle to Dr. Pym. Hey, resistance guy. Care to fill us in? This is a safe house. Yeah, it doesn't seem safe to me. Don't look directly at the bee, kid!
side vents are vulnerable again. Detecting a massive teleport signature. Ah, damn it! Hank, evacuate the Ed Hill now. I don't think so. Hank, that doesn't look ready. Come on, Tony, live a little. Unbelievable! It worked. Congratulations, Dr. Pym. The Resistance has an impressive new weapon. It's sort of cute when they're small. Thanks, guys. I owe you one. Thanks for your help out there. I'll have the Pym particles you need transported to the Chimera. Thanks, Doc. I know you won't listen, but I'll say it anyway. Be careful. I'll do my best. Here are the particles Dr. Pym promised. Good luck, Iron Man. Thanks. I'm, uh, gonna need it. So what exactly is this Starboost thing? Meet me in the tech lab, kid, and see for yourself. Every test I did before ended badly. But with this new miniaturized accelerator, I have a shot.
That looks awesome. Because it is awesome. $1.4 billion vanity project. I may incinerate on takeoff, but I'll look damn good doing it. All systems are in the green, sir. But I must warn you, a large storm system has moved into your direct flight path. Never rains, but it pours. Well, we can't wait any longer. Tony, I loaded up some music to give you a little boost. Oh, no. Don't worry, it's not mine. You can do this. Thanks, kid. Okay. Three, two, one. juice left in these repulsors. Hopefully this place isn't crawling with guards. Okay, let's see what we got. Wait a minute. Well, this doesn't make sense. Regenerative formula. That'll explain Tarleton's giant head. That's its source. Probably some unfortunate inhuman. Okay, let's find that door. No sweat. Rescue that inhuman. No more regen formula, no more adaptoids. High fives all around. Just a little hack through this next door without waking anybody up. Unauthorized life form detected. Oh, hey! You mean me!
Bingo. at all. you letting go I just we thought I mean I thought that it's good to have you back Captain. I'm so come confused on. yeah come on gotta get you out of here come on wait 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 Tarleton did he survive Tarleton who cares what the explosion he was too close he survived Thanks to you, apparently. And Monica, if you believe the news stories. That doesn't make sense. <coughs> okay, I got you. The evacuation. All those people. Yeah, we'll get to that. You think you can walk? Yeah, it's okay. I'm good. Let's do this. Well, there's the cap I remember. Come on. Okay. What's the plan? Uh, well, we find an escape pod and, uh, escape. You're winging this, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Actually, didn't think I'd make it this far. <clears throat> Tony, where is everyone? Where's here? Oh, well, we're in space. My God. You weren't kidding. <gasps> nope. Riding a bike, I guess. It's down from here. You ready to jump? Tony. What's... What's happening? Well, it's a long story. How long was I? Yeah, well, five years. Which, by your standards, is just a power nap. Starting to think people just prefer me on ice. See? You're already making jokes. Corny ones. But that's normal for you. Captain Rogers. What is this? Don't leave us just yet. Monica! Long time no see. Can't imagine your buddy Tarleton was too thrilled about using superhero blood to replace superheroes. He leaves the details to me. Stop what you're doing. Now. Wait a minute. Georgie doesn't know about any of this. And he never will. Self-destruct sequence initiated. Uh-oh. I think we made her mad. Tony! I'm working on it! All right, got it. Let's go! What the hell? Oh, don't mind the killer robots. Hurry! Get it open! I'm trying! For a dead guy, you're really pushing. Gonna have to brute force this thing. Why didn't you start with that?
the other side. Time for a fight. Let's move. Watch out! Ah, damn it! Watch ah! that glass, Cap. It can't hold your weight. Almost there, Cap. is we're not gonna die in a fiery ball of death. And the bad news? We'll uh, most likely suffocate first. <sighs> well, at least it's a good view. That it is. Damn it. So close. <sighs> well, since we're gonna die anyway, you have any, I don't know, last confessions? Your jokes. I just don't get them. I know, I read your diary. <laughs> Why'd you smash the reactor cap? A lot of people died. Tony, there was something buried deep beneath the bay. Somehow linked to the reactor, working its way to the surface every minute. It was the earthquake. I had to do something. The entire San Andreas Fault was about to blow. The ocean would have consumed the city. Millions would have died. I never doubted you for a second. Just had to hear it, you know? What the hell is that? Well, look who it is. Am I always going to save the day? I expect nothing less from the God of Thunder. Hi, Thor. Welcome back, Captain. your regenerative formula. George? How long have I been your lab rat? I knew you'd react like this. You'd rather die than need something from them. I trusted you. You saved your life. You can control machines with your mind. Just think of you all the You infected me with his blood. It could have killed me. But it didn't. Remember the dream, George. How could you make me one of them? I made you strong. You stole my hope. And now... I am going to give you the same odds that I had. <laughs> I will rip the 
earth of superpowers. <gasps> Even if it has to end with me. Hey there, old friend. They had you. This isn't on you. Tarleton didn't even know Monica had me. What? Ade. The heist. Monica hired Taskmaster to steal a Terrigen crystal. His men triggered the security protocols, initiating the Chimera's autopilot. But, <sighs> but that thing in the bay, that was unexpected. The heat signal. It must have been what caused the earthquake that took down the city. What was that? I don't know. Nat, I... I just keep thinking. If I hadn't... All those people... No. This is not your fault. That ship was never supposed to be in the air. I would have done the same thing. You're alive. I knew it! I'm sorry. Um, come on. You should really see this. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to be back. Since the Chimera's near crash into Manhattan, the situation has become dire. I fear AIM will use this as an opportunity to ramp up their persecution of all the Inhumans. We can't let that happen. The world needs the Avengers now more than ever. We are preparing for our final confrontation with AIM. I have completed my analysis of Mr. Stark's plans to equip the Avengers for this anticipated confrontation, and will need some special materials to complete them. Thanks, Jarvis. Time for us to get back in fighting form. Let's see what we need. Excellent, sir. As part of the effort, we might want to help our allies. Commander Hill and Dr. Pym are both reporting serious difficulty in coordinating our efforts due to AIM's draconian control over world communication networks. How can we help? They have requested we destroy AIM's main communication hub to help unite the Resistance efforts. Let's oblige them, old friend. Speaking of the media, reports of our own Thor Odinson working with ex-AIM scientists in a remote part of Scandinavia have started cropping up on the news. This may be part of AIM's propaganda campaign against the Avengers, but it bears investigation. Agreed. Let's get Thor on this ASAP. Commander Hill, AIM's been spreading their lies about the Resistance for way too long. It has to stop. It's time we replace their poisonous lies with the truth. Their satellite array is vast. As long as that network is in place, they'll control the narrative. Jarvis has identified several AIM satellite hubs that control their communications. I see what you're thinking. If we can take one out, their network would collapse. 
At least for a few hours. We'd be able to send messages to the entire Resistance. Temporarily. So we'll have to make every word we broadcast count. We don't have any weapons strong enough to take out a satellite, so what's the play? The satellite is connected to Earth by a massive space elevator. That's how we'll get up there. First thing you'll have to do is acquire the launch code for this space elevator. That'll be risky. It'll be worth it, Hill. The resistance is still fragile. We need a way to organize our forces. Open lines of communications will be critical. I assume you know where to find a set of codes? Jarvis did some digging. A local AIM base commander has some, so we're gonna pay them a visit. Go get those launch codes. There is a chest with gear close by. Look for a chest with gear nearby. I require assistance! I'm guessing the big one's the base commander. The one in the central area, yes. Let's get his intention. There's a chest with special resources close to your location. codes now. Time for an elevator ride? Not quite. Commander. The elevator is controlled by a multi-point authentication system powered by three junction boxes. Jarvis will need control of them to fake the authentication to get you inside. Why can't it ever be easy? shield allies nearby could use some help. Get access to the three junctions keeping the security system locked down so Jarvis can get inside. AIM's gonna try to kick him out, so you'll need to keep their forces at bay. The more junctions, the better. Keep at him. The ones and zeros he's spitting out seem promising, but we need to keep control of the junctions. Ames got control of a junction. They're trying to lock out Jarvis. Ames got 
lost control of a junction. They're trying to lock out Jarvis. On it. Coming at you! Alright, Jarvis is gonna start now. Nice light workout. Attack! You have to get aim off those junctions. Disabled. You're clear to go, Cap. All right, this is it. One super long elevator ride coming up. A warning, sir. This is going to be a rather rocky ride. Oh. Everyone, hold on. Incredible. No telling what kind of defenses this satellite has. We get in. Set the place to self-destruct, and then get the hell out. Clear? Crystal. Keep your head! Find the console to open the central hub's doors. Watch yep. out! I still got it. AIM really likes redundancies, don't they? They do. You gotta take everything down or that satellite will stay up. We're standing by, Cap. As soon as you take the satellite out, we'll send out a message as wide as possible. Power overloading across the station. Yes! Take that! Warning, station integrity critical. Please 
evacuate immediately. Jarvis, broadcast the message. Certainly, sir. This is Captain America. To anyone out there resisting the tyranny of AIM, to everyone who's scared or doesn't know where to turn, the Avengers are back, and we won't let you down again. Fellow Americans, we're here where protesters have gathered in response to a nationwide threat to our freedom. This morning, the heads of all major military agencies were held under duress by AIM's new adaptoids. Panic erupted when many awoke to large AIM gunships hovering above our major cities. As the military begins to mobilize, a tense standoff has gripped the nation. Of course. That's my tech. That is my cloaking tech. Wait a minute. Something's happening. <laughs> Sir, I'm receiving a distress call from a resistance sanctuary in New York. Ames trying to draw us out. If we rescue them, it'll look like we're attacking. It doesn't matter what it looks like. We see someone who needs help, and we help. So you do what you need to do. We're leaving at dawn. Hey, Cap. I got Pim to send us what he has on New York if you want to take a look. Meet me in the tech lab. On my way. Right, Nat? What have we got? Turns out Pym has been tracking that thing since it showed up in the sky. It doesn't seem to follow a set route, so we can't anticipate its movements. His best guess is that it responds to activity alerts from AIM's agents, coupled with its own sensors. It's gonna see us coming. Probably. The Resistance will feed us their data, so we'll have intel on its location at all times. That should at least give us a leg up. Great. Get the Quinjet set up. I want to be ready for takeoff ASAP. Consider it done. Dr. Pym, we've heard Ames about to unveil adaptoids the public's never seen. I plan to storm their main New York lab and ruin the party. I wish I could help, but I'm short-handed. Some of my best people were recently captured by AIM. That's just it. They're being held near New York's adaptoid project facility. The plan is we swing by AIM's local weapons cache first, get some upgrades, then we head over to bust your folks out before wrecking AIM's fancy adaptoid research lab. That sounds pretty awesome. I'll send my reserve teams into the area to back you up. Thanks. We can use all the help we can get. I've got teams on the ground, but AIMS come out fighting. There are pitched battles on the streets. Tell your people to stand firm. The Avengers are on their way.
A resistance unit is fighting for its life near your location. Updating your HUD. Let's give him a hand before we hit that weapons cache. They won't know what... I can't believe we're fighting in the street. Where are the cameras when you need them? AIM would no doubt push the narrative the resistance of the proverbial bad guys and that their troops are simply defending themselves against lawless aggressors. a hole through Ames weapons catch. Dr. Pym, did you get those coordinates Jarvis sent? I've already got a team engaged with AIM forces on site. We're on our way. AIM seemed determined to protect a building that officially only stores administrative records. They sure do. Let's take care of these security forces and then get in there. AIM units... Come on. Let's show AIM they can't stop the Resistance and the Avengers, especially when we work together.
rest with gear nearby. I don't believe it! We're through! All part of the plan. I've marked the elevator on your HUD. Doc, hold your people back until the area is secure. Once it's clear, they can come in and get kitted up. Uh, Theo insists on helping you out, and there's literally no way I could stop him. Understood. Guess we'll buddy up, Theo. Works for me, Cap. Let's get your people some better weapons, Doc. Is it my birthday? It kinda feels like my birthday when you say things like that. One of our resistance allies is close by and could use some help. Each cache is shielded. I'll need to expose each generator, then destroy it so your people can get access. Use the control panel inside to access the generators. Work quickly as they will not stay exposed for long. Aim certainly know how to build impressive handheld equipment. The generator's exposed. I'll just... Feel here, ready to fight. Open. Nice work. Shield generator will be vulnerable now. Attack formation! Force field is down. Just gotta take out the adaptoid. This is gonna hurt.
here. Feeling ready to break out some resistance members, Doc? Hell yeah. With these weapons, we can finally fight AIM on a more even footing. My people will take what they need. Theo's already delivering hardware, so our street teams are armed ASAP. Express delivery. I like it. Glad to be of help. These weapons are amazing, Cap. They're really gonna make a difference out there. Glad to be of help. We'll need them if we want to win this war against AIM. Now, let's go get your people out of those cells. Thanks. AIM having Inhumans on display like that is just wrong. I bet they plan to release them at some point and use their new Adaptoid models to save the city. Okay, I'm topside and en route. Those are Adaptoid delivery pods. How many more of them have AIM deployed? Excellent question. Good thing we've commandeered some new weapons. Hit him hard and fast. Once we free the resistance members, they'll help us take down AIM's lab. Even with the Avengers here, are we sure we can handle this many AIM units? Great question, Doc. Commander Hill, what's your status? Key team should be with you now. That answer your question? Excellent. Now, just disable each cell's power source to open them up. Great job, they're free. Thank you. That did it. Theo, work your magic. You're safe now. Knock him down!
latest adaptoid project at Visit. Lead the way, Cap. <laughs> I love it when we take the fight to AIM. Careful, Cap. AIM's pouring in more units, and the bridge leading to your objective would be a great place to bottleneck you. Understood, Commander. Thanks. Watch out, Cap. That group's targeting you. I see them, Commander. Down AIM's latest adaptoid project will show the world they're not invincible. They'll do their best to spin it and make themselves the victims. Agreed. But some people will know the truth. That makes this all worth it. Our goal is the top of that tower. Let's make it happen. <laughs> Bad guy. 
Worked hard for this shot, people. Be ready for anything. I'm picking up a lot of aim activity on the top floor. I'm counting on it. Aim appears to have mobilized a group of modified adaptoids. Beware. Got it. <sighs> Aim's throwing everything they can at us, but together we can beat them. Just. Don't look down if you're scared of heights. This is it, people. Let's work together and show AIM how we do things. Got lucky. No. We worked together and got the job done. Damn right we did. AIM wants the world to believe we're the bad guys. That the Avengers, S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Resistance are here to do harm. But some people already suspect the truth. AIM seeks to take, not give. And their adaptoids are here to control, not help. We need to do everything we can to spread the word and let folks know they're not alone. It won't be easy. Maybe not, but we've got the truth on our side. And I like to believe that still counts for something. And now we've got each other. What do you say? Together, we just gave the world a glimpse of AIM's true colors. Exposing their real face will take time, persistence, and patience. But I know we can do it. I'm proud of all of you. S.H.I.E.L.D.'s always ready to help give AIM a bloody nose, Cap. You know that. <laughs> Freeing my people would have been enough. But getting those cutting-edge AIM weapons was the icing on the cake.
Sir, S.H.I.E.L.D. intercepted a somewhat bizarre exchange on an old AIM frequency. I have seen much that mortals would deem bizarre. Listen for yourself. The prototype device is ready, my lord. You have done well, loyal one. That's... that's my voice! Gather the Woken, and we will begin. What trickery is this? Jarvis, what can you tell us? Only that the communication originated in Scandinavia. I have no records about any Woken. This cannot go unchallenged. We leave immediately. We need to find out who these Woken are, and what their prototype device does. And let us not forget the one impersonating me. Poorly. I thought they were rather accurate. They were not. So you're not flattered? Well, I think there's a lot more going on here than identity theft. The message originated from this forest. Records show there's a decommissioned AIM base here. And yet the buildings remain. That's not AIM protocol. They'd usually strip it clean. And the mystery deepens. begin to suspect AIM never left this place. I'm not so sure. This doesn't feel like their M.O. Either way, let's get to where that call came from. What is that? Twisted monument dedicated to me and... Path home. Never that would be. Okay, let's check it out. Carefully. A trap! Looks like it. Jarvis? I'll scan the monument and get answers. Battle is here! structure that just started emitting strange energy readings. Then our mission is clear. Surely our imposter in this machine lie within. Let's check it out. The structure is... Sealed. That I should be able to bypass the main door controls. The Woken appear familiar to you as well. Yes. Either they're part of AIM, or some kind of radical offshoot. Look for a chest with gear nearby. Look for a chest containing special resources nearby. Destroy the false god! Dear, I am the one true god! I don't think these Woken can be reasoned with, sir. There's the entrance.
gotcha. We need assistance. Deceiver, and we shall see who is worthy of the name Thor. Oh, my worshippers' faith is not in question. Woken, hear me! The false god comes! Destroy him! Enemy sighted. I would not sully Mjolnir with your blood. Face instead my understudy. Coward! We shall destroy your automaton, and you next!
You okay, big guy? This false Thor vows his followers will join him in Asgard. Should they truly seek to open a way, a disaster can result. This woman, Helen Gable, spoke of documents. I must find them. Digital records are unlikely to exist. I must try. The name of Thor has been used to sow lies. I will put an end to it. Or die in the attempt. Jarvis, play the message. Certainly, Miss Romanov. Mayday! The Woken hit our Quinjet with an unknown energy weapon. We're going down and need assistance. Repeat, need immediate assistance. Where did this happen? A remote forest region in eastern Norway, sir. I asked S.H.I.E.L.D. to see what they could dig up about our least favorite Asgard-worshipping cult. And the charlatan posing as me. Those agents are in trouble because they were following a lead. Our lead. They shall be saved. In Odin's name, I swear. Anything that can knock a Quinjet out of the sky is WMD level, which makes the Woken a major threat. Perhaps their weapon is connected to the machine they were attempting to build when we last encountered them. If I may, sir, the first clash with the Woken somewhat disturbed you. So keep your head on straight. You truly think I would shirk my duty? No, but I think this hits close to home for you, and a smart enemy will try to exploit that. Sir, I've established contact with the Stranded Shield team. Avengers, our luck just ran out. There's a lot of movement in the forest. The Woken are here. Better get to them before it's too late.
originating from a site nearby. I believe I know what the Woken seek to do. If I am right, the entire world is in terrible danger. It's not a weapon at all, is it? Our shield friends got too close to what? A test of some kind? I believe the Woken wish to open a path to Asgard. But mortal machinery cannot control such forces. We must destroy their device. Something is not right. Woken forces inbound. Damn it, it's an ambush. Fight power. Stop. appears once more. You poor fools! Don't listen to his lies! You were right about the bridge. Damn it! I believe Master Odinson is referring to the Bifrost. Without the power of Heimdall, their device will tear apart the very fabric of reality. And it's even worse than I thought. We must move. Now, the fate of the universe hangs in the balance. There is a chest with gear close by. to speak for me. Where are you now? 
you have gone unchallenged too long. Look at this. I am Thor, God of Thunder, and your evil will darken Midgard no more! Woken are still a threat. Just because they failed this time doesn't mean they won't try again. I am to blame. I thought I could lay down the hammer. But in my absence, this evil took root. Well, we did save the universe. So I'm glad you came back. As am I, brave Natasha. As am I. What is it, Jarvis? Per your request, I've been scanning for residual gamma radiation. I've detected large quantities coming from a complex deep inside AIM territory. AIM and gamma? How? Monica's trying to replicate my research. And I gave her everything she needed. I'm sorry, Bruce. I trusted her. I assume you'd like to infiltrate the facility. And make sure she's stopped. Yes. Where are we headed? I've uploaded the coordinates to the Quinjet. Since Monica co-founded AIM, Dr. Banner has feared the amount of gamma radiation research she amassed while they were colleagues. Recently, I've detected residual gamma radiation coming from a remote AIM facility. Dr. Banner would like you to infiltrate the gamma radiation lab and destroy any research you find. Dr. Banner has pre-recorded a message for you, Hulk. Hey, big guy. Um... If Monica's there, just do the job, okay? Listen to Jarvis and Kamala if they tell you to rein it in. And, uh, thank you. You're stopping what I can. The gamma readings are coming from an underground facility not far from your current location. This is in the heart of AIM territory. Yes. There will be significant resistance on your path. Take out those guards. Oh, it's the Hulk. Don't let him inside. 
You think Abomination was created here? Unlikely. Ames' holdings were diminutive when Abomination first appeared. It is possible he was enhanced here, however. Not comforting. This is the server floor for Ames' Gamma Research program. Hulk smash. You got that right! They're inside. Don't let them get to the servers. Look for a chest containing special resources nearby. Could use some help. That terminal will give you access to the Gamma Laboratory ahead. Research data is housed on several servers to prevent loss during power failures. You will have to destroy them all to prevent further experiments. Security, what's going on? I'm getting alerts across the board. I'll handle it. All units, stop them! It appears Dr. Rappuccini is aware of your presence. Security, one of the servers has gone dark. What are you doing up there? Is Monik in the building? Proceed down into the facility. Seems like the big guy doesn't like Monica very much either. I do not have much data on the shared emotional relationships between Dr. Banner and the Hulk. Could be he's like a bloodhound who can sense bad people just by smelling them. I'm not sure he'd appreciate the comparison. <laughs> Don't care. All right, time to find Monica. You really are that gullible, aren't you? Wait, what? Barricade the door. Protect the research lab. There is a chest with special resources close to your location.
much. So Bane has a good health here. In some trouble here. installation has been rendered inoperable. Make sure Bruce gets this message. You are going to regret this with every fiber of your being. Yeah, no, I don't think we will. The Avengers are gonna take you down, Monica. It's only a matter of time. Hey, big guy, I, uh, I appreciate the assist on this mission. I know you're not a fan of Code Green, but in order to bring the world back in balance, we need you out in the field. Destroying Monica's gamma research should keep her from creating an army of abominations. But, just in case, I've directed Jarvis to keep an eye out for any more signs of gamma emissions. If she brings another lab online, you'll be there to smash it. Though AIM's gamma program has been depleted, a new experiment was already in progress of which we were not aware. According to the research you gathered, AIM is trying to recreate the process that resulted in abomination on a larger scale. Here are the coordinates of the laboratory developing this process. <gasps> Smash! This laboratory specializes solely in gamma experimentation. <laughs> Abomination was their most successful prototype. Better get in there. Guessing this is the lab? Yes. 
and Amos sent a large security contingent to guard it. <laughs> Not large! Time to shut them down! town called Venture Ridge, Wyoming. through local police chatter now. We're tracking three groups of civilians stuck downtown. There are still people in the parking garage on 7th. It's not safe to go outside. No, AIM started the experiment already. <sighs> Oh, good job. Oh, my, my, my. What the 
could be Ains new gamma transformation process. Time to go smash it. The machine in question is releasing toxic gamma gas into the air throughout town. If it does not kill when inhaled, it could potentially mutate the victim into a gamma-powered creature. In order to disable the machine without releasing more gamma into the air, I'll need to be in proximity of the device without aim interference. Stay close to the machine and keep aim forces out of range. sent an elite team to install an additional gamma radiation device. The police are going to be evacuating people any second. Hulk, you have to stop them. Oh, these are not normal goons. This is a high-profile project within AIM's hierarchy. They pulled quite a few resources to protect them. Take them down, Hulk!
detecting another large gamma life form beneath the town. It can't be. It can. Abomination is here. <sighs> Sending you the location of a possible entrance to Ames underground observation facility. It's time to give our old friend a hello. There's the elevator. <sighs> Made it. If we can't do this the peaceful way, we'll do it with a bang. God, it's Abomination! He's here! No, no, we're too late. Still time. Hulk, I don't know what's going on, but you have to end this for Bruce. He feels guilty for letting you get in on all his gamma research. That's why he's been so hard on you. Ah! <laughs> 
got awesome news. Uh, clearly. W what is it? Jarvis spied on some AIM emails about the Gamma program. It's officially scrapped. That's good news, yeah? Yeah, yes. I, I just wish it hadn't needed to be done. You didn't know what Monica was gonna do. I thought she wanted to learn from my mistakes. Turns out she wanted to perfect them. Not anymore, though. No. Not anymore. That's because of you and the Hulk. That whole town is safe from AIM and any other town that was gonna come after it. It is one of the few things the big guy and I have in common. Huh? We don't want what happened to us to happen to anyone else. And now, it won't. Exactly. He did good, Hulk. More than good. I think you and I, uh, we aren't enemies. If there's anything to be learned from what Monica did to me, she never saw you as an enemy. You are a gift. I promise to see you that way too, and... Uh, yeah, I'm sorry for everything. What's the play? Not sure there's any chance of us getting into this city undetected. Yeah, pretty sure you rising from the dead is gonna attract attention. Then we give them something to draw their attention. Like maybe a son of Odin. <laughs> I will bring the lightning, Captain. They won't even see you on the ground. We're being hailed, sir. Put them through. Hello? Anyone out there? They found us. They say we need to be cured, but we know what that means. Please, someone... What's this? Someone found a radio? <laughs> Don't worry. You'll all be cured soon. Jarvis, can you get a location? Right away, sir. I've traced the call back to an apartment in the evacuation zone. I don't get it. Why are they evacuating? Because of us, and humans. To them, we're a disease. AIM has people believing they're dangerous. It's only gotten worse over the years. There they are! Intruder alert! Code red! Sit tight. We'll get you out of here. Those power cells control the locking mechanism. <laughs> There is a chest with gear close by. That did it. Theo, work your magic. You're safe now. Inhumans. Our friends were on the way to the safe house. We'll find them. Go now. Find safety, my friend. Better hurry. 
Don't know how many of these guys are out there. I've located another containment cell. How could we let this happen? We have a chance to stop them now. There is an elite aim unit near you. Defeat them, and you may gain something useful. One of our resistance allies is close by and could use some help. They're empty. What's dead should stay dead, Captain. And the weak give way to the strong. Those guys lost too. familiar. Ooh, I feel seen. Look for a chest containing special resources nearby. Get off me! Watchdogs! Protect the inhumans! Avengers, help! Get them! We can halt the infection! No one else will suffer! We're not infected! sending agents to escort the survivors out of the city. He's alerted them, but they're trapped inside, forwarding the code to the safe house entrance. That flying thing is heading right for it. The trolls must have found it. Just say one of us can fly. We have to get them out of there. Not by accident. <laughs>
Not sure how much we've got. Watchdogs are closing in. Safe house is nearby. I'm picking up something in the atmosphere. A derivative of Terrigen, but I've never seen anything like it. Are we in danger here? Aren't we always? True. Avengers! Come on! Glad you're here. We can't. They have this thing hunting in humans. We tried to sneak out, but they have eyes everywhere. We'll take care of the watchdogs. Don't worry. Not them. That thing in the sky. It's here. Stay down until the resistance comes for you. Four. Looks like we're gonna need some air support on this one. Whatever this new threat is, I will meet it in the sky. Terrigen levels rising. Activate respirators. Machine is the source of the Alter Terrigen. It's been genetically modified to seek out the presence of the inhuman gene and eliminate the host. It's killing inhumans? Not for long.
is this thing? Let's get its black box back to the Chimera. I'll do some digging. Jarvis, I've uploaded the warship's transmitter database. Trace launch location. Retracing flight path. That dark Terrigen. Tarleton wants to kill us all. We have to do something. He can't cure the Inhumans, so he's gonna take them all out. And this is just the beginning. Sir? What do we got? According to the flight path, the machine originated from the San Francisco Bay. No. No, that's not possible. I flew over that area dozens of times after A-Day. Perhaps this is a ruse. They mean to throw us off course. Unlikely. Residual radiation and mineral deposits on the wreckage confirms the craft has been in the Bay Area recently. Then how did no one see it? Same way they didn't see the warships coming. It's cloaked. A quarantine. No aircraft, no ships in or out. Hiding in plain sight. Exactly. Sir, I've just intercepted a signal. Warships. Hundreds of them deploying out of San Francisco. No! No, they'll kill thousands if we don't stop them! Then we go to the source. And shut it down. Jarvis, plot a course to San Francisco. At once, Captain. Okay. Well, if we're going into battle with our big-headed friends, Death Fortress, Robot Army, and the flotilla of warships, we might as well look good doing it, right? Jarvis, do you have the fortress? Mapping radiation signatures now. George, your boy sure has been busy. They're right on top of your heat signal cap. That must be the source of Ames Terrigen. Now take us down. Kamala and I will take out the main control tower. Thor, Tony, knock out as many of those generators as you can. We stop that signal. We stop those warships. Hulk. Clear a path. Bam! Aim is down another hangar. Or three. Pace yourself, Stark. Hey, some people don't have a thousand years of blowing stuff up to look forward to, Rapunzel. Oh, he missed you, Thor. Feels like only yesterday we were all together. Bring the dad jokes, Captain. Okay. You're in for it now! Make your appearance. Brings a tear to my eyes to see you. 
you all assemble together again. You're making this easy for me. Offering yourselves up for the slaughter. The hell is this? Let me guess. Robots glowing purple? Molten? Yeah. We can control units remotely. Take those out first. Is he house trained? Mistake, George. Don't call me that. George failed. Modoc won't. We can't cure this or what we've become. What are you saying? Power cannot be controlled. I know that now. It has to be destroyed. No. Our sacrifice will be remembered, Captain. <laughs> I'm guessing you all caught that. Let's take out that signal tower. And his face. I'm with her. As am I. Big guy? We can't get to the last transmitter in the Quinjet. Too much cover fire. We got this. The door ahead leads to the transmitter's base. I'll follow Hulk's lead. And try not to fall to my death. Good plan. Give me a second. Accessing the system. Get that door open. On it. Keep an eye on its force field generators. When they pulse yellow, take them out. Kill Captain Rogers. Without him, no trouble. Hey, I think I understood that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, there's a teenager on this channel. Watch your mouth. This is futile, Captain. You're leading your people to their death as they once led you to yours. And full blood. None of your adoring fans will know you died for them. Eesh, really got the whole villain monologue thing down, doesn't it? Five years of practice. She's starting to sound like you, Stark. Oh, we'll work on it. Anyone else? Kind of remind me of another flying suit of armor. Oh, how dare you talk about Thor like that? Oh, I can't believe I'm fighting with the Avengers. Nat, I'm not 
not seeing any yellow force field generators. They will be by the door. Just give me a minute. Oh, I guess a five-year nap makes a man impatient. The captain has high expectations for all of us. We shall exceed them. See? Someone's got the right attitude. Generators, Cap. Take down that shield. Thanks, Nat. The defense shield is down, Nat. How's that door coming? Hard to hack and fight at the same time. Are you not having fun? Did you see what I'm seeing? Those are deathoids! They've got inhuman powers! I see them. We've got our job here. Let Cap do his. Reason must guide our future now. The time for heroes is over. The bobblehead's still talking? Really?
if I put on a few pounds? That's not what I mean. Hey, not everyone's a super soldier now. Ten bucks says Tony's on a juice class. I'll take that wager. I'll take the fifth. Some sort of power conduit room. Probably for the last transmitter. Everything's electrified. Look for fail-safe switches. Team's gotta have a way to shut things down for repairs. There's something wrong! We should have spotted in humans by now! Think about how high security the prison was. AIM's not gonna give them up that easy. But we can't free them until we know AIM's not gonna gas them into oblivion. Tony, some tact would be good. Right, sorry. Kamala. No, you're right! We have to stop that signal! Already on it. Just keep me covered. Captain, you weren't there. You didn't hear the testimonies, the pain. No one should have to live like this. On that at least, we agree. I've seen what happens when the people in power decide who deserves to live, Doctor. I'm not about to let history repeat itself. Then don't force us to live through another A-Day. I don't think you and I did, George. That's part of the problem. This easy.
The transmitter's power source is somewhere just above you. Up it is. Last core. The transmission should be dead. No, I'm still reading a signal from the excavation site. The heat signal I saw on A Day. It caused the earthquakes. Whatever's behind those walls, Modoc doesn't want us to get it. Got bigger problems, Captain. Shit. <laughs> Beacon must have been a decoy. Somehow Tarleton's still transmitting. You struggle against the unstoppable tide of progress, Avengers. This just got a whole lot weirder. What has happened to his face? You can throw me down, but I have enough mist to blanket the world. Avengers. No more ships make it out of the quarantine zone. <laughs> Tony, take out those thrusters. Thought you'd never ask. Come on, George, you're killing innocent people. No crypts, Stark. That's not like you. Might be able to take out his thrusters.
It will make no difference. Inhumanity is a blight on this earth. I'll take it from here. Everyone fan out. Buy me some time. Monica already contaminated me with your blood, Captain Rogers. She made me into the thing I hate the most. I'm willing to die with them now. For the good of all. Lots of power coming off that thing on his back. Oh, no. Maybe if you take out his main thruster. Good call. That might give me a window. I think we've got bigger problems. Yeah, on it. You cannot win.
try again. Good isn't a thing you are. 
happening. Oh no. No, no, not again. Hey. You're alive. Oh, take it easy. Right. You got hard, kid. Great job. Yeah, we need to work on that passing out thing, but you did good. Indeed. Good. <laughs> that was pretty badass. Thanks. Hey, can you guys give us a moment? What? All this time, I, I thought I was mentoring you and... I'd given up. I guess what I'm trying to say is... Thank you. Can I ask you a favor? You know you're grounded till you're 30, yes? Yes. Good. From now on, nothing but school. And your... your special field trips. Really? Oh, Abu! <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Beta. But, uh, let's not tell Ami, okay? Okay. <laughs> Do we have snacks? Of course. I'm hungry. As the newly elected Scientist Supreme, I will weed out the weak elements from within. No more surprises. No more distractions from our goals. Only carefully crafted innovation. Make no mistake, AIM is still the future. From cloning to time travel, the possibilities are endless. Now, Let's begin. Commander Hill, what's the situation? Good to see you again, Cap. 
I wish it was under better circumstances, but we think AIM might have a new leader, someone with ambitious plans to expand their operations. Is it really ambition if you have the government and public opinion on your side? We can change people's minds, Tony, even if we have to act outside the law. Well, I do love breaking the rules. S.H.I.E.L.D. is still getting back on its feet, but we've been able to gather intel on AIM's operations. They haven't missed a beat since San Francisco. Here's where it gets weird. Our sources tell us AIM has been experimenting with cloning technology, new synthoids, and we believe they're exploring potential uses of cosmic energy. And here I hoped cloning would be the weird part. The world still needs the Avengers. Maybe now more than ever. You can count on us. Good. If our intel is right, we're gonna need all the help we can get. I've got some field ops lined up when you're ready. The harm room is back online on the lower deck, so you can train up if you need to. We got a big job ahead of us. Commander Hill, what's the situation? Good to see you again, Cap. I wish it was under better circumstances, but we think AIM might have a new leader, someone with ambitious plans to expand their operations. Is it really ambition if you have the government and public opinion on your side? We can change people's minds, Tony, even if we have to act outside the law. Well, I do love breaking the rules. S.H.I.E.L.D. is still getting back on its feet, but we've been able to gather intel on AIM's operations. They haven't missed a beat since San Francisco. Here's where it gets weird. Our sources tell us AIM has been experimenting with cloning technology, new synthoids, and we believe they're exploring potential uses of cosmic energy. And here I hoped cloning would be the weird part. The world still needs the Avengers. Maybe now more than ever. You can count on us. Good. If our intel is right, we're gonna need all the help we can get. I've got some field ops lined up when you're ready. The harm room is back online on the lower deck, so you can train up if you need to. We got a big job ahead of us. Avengers, we need a threat assessment from your end. Something's not right. I'll explain the details in person. I sent the coordinates of my location to your war table. It's time we met face to face. Welcome to S.H.I.E.L.D. Substation Zero, Avengers. This was another one of Fury's secrets, but moving forward, it'll be S.H.I.E.L.D.'s new base of operations. We've reached out to our best operatives, so you'll find plenty of familiar faces here. Get yourselves acquainted and meet me in my office. Good to see you in person. We'll be working more directly moving forward. Hologram calls can only do so much. What I'm about to say may sound absurd, but Dr. Pym assured me it's a real threat. We've encountered time disruptions across the world. Tucky on storms, as we call it. We'll need an experienced, hard-hitting task force to investigate these sites. You are the perfect candidate. Our agents will provide mission support whenever possible. Agent Morales volunteered to track these tacky on storms. Report to her and we can get started. Hey, Avenger, I got a job for you. Good to see you again. Glad we could work together on this op. <sighs> Tachyon storms are sweeping across the world, more frequent by the day. We don't know what's causing them or why, but we need answers, Stat. We believe they're related to the disruptions we've been experiencing here, like a hiccup in time or intense deja vu. I've identified a site that's producing near-constant tachyon emissions. Seems like the perfect starting point.
Well, if AIM's involved in all these tachyon disruptions, it means they're blazing new trails in mad scientist. Ing. And with Monica leading AIM as scientist supreme, she'll be making things a lot more difficult. Please don't make me miss Georgie boy. Tachyon disruptions, increased production capacity, AIM scaling at an alarming rate. Well, let's drop in for a safety inspection. I have a feeling their days without an accident sign is about to be reset. Unknown transmission incoming. Okay, I don't know who's flying that bird, but you're in the wrong airspace, pal. Uh, Jarvis, we didn't call for backup, did we? Holy crap. The Avengers? We, I, I gotta uh, put you on hold for a second. Okay, then. Hey, Jarvis, you got a trace on that call? The call originated from the facility ahead. It appears you have a fan. Always nice to be appreciated. She sounds familiar. How odd. I'm picking up some unusual interference nearby. Odd and unusual. Might just be what we're looking for. Aim units up ahead. They appear to be investigating something. Let's hit them while they're distracted. We're done here. Huh, this aimbot looks rigged to blow. Thermal discombobulation, sir. No doubt it attracted AIM's attention. It's a diversion. Looks like our fan is causing a little trouble of her own. I'm picking up several distress calls. AIM security is on high alert. Guess that ruins our easy entrance. Let's get to that facility pronto. If we're quick, maybe we can still salvage this thing. We need to find out how Monica's involved in this tachyon. You picked a 
an awful time to follow me, Stark. Yeah, that wasn't the plan, trust me. AIM has deployed gatekeepers to maintain security. You'll need to dispose of them before I can get into their system. to keep you waiting, Tony. Tony? Wait, do we know each other? You don't remember me? Oh, that kind of stings. Well, I know a lot of people. How about a hint? Okay, let's see. Uh, World-class archer and gymnast? No? Part-time private investigator? Full-time genius? Looks slamming in purple? <laughs> what? It's Kate, dummy. Kate Bishop? But you're a little kid. A little tiny. Kid. You know I was 19, right? You make it sound like Hawkeye was training a baby. What are you doing here? Where have you been? There'll be time to catch up later. Hopefully. Meet me inside. We're on the right floor. Where to, Kate? Follow the robot trail, and you'll find the hangar. I'll meet you there. Lots of busted robots in here. You did a lot of damage. Did you bring a wrecking crew or something? Yeah, me. Not bad, kid. Not bad at all. Seeing anything interesting? Something about tachyon disruptions, maybe? Um, close to something. What? Who knows? The hangar is just up ahead. Find the correct terminal, and I'll take care of the rest. Got it. There is a chest with gear close by. And open. And it's not open. Oh, great! Looks like he's got me boxed in. I'm afraid I can't lift the emergency monitor through this terminal.
cool. Uh, I don't mean to rush you, but AIM knows you're here, which means they know I'm here, and they're not going to be happy about any of it. So... Okay, what am I looking for? Okay, I found something. Oh, crap. Ah! Hey, Kate, you there? We've lost her signal, sir. It appears communications are being scrambled. Get us into their system. You'll need to maintain control of all three consoles. Just so you We have control of this terminal. One's ours. Your knight in high-tech armor is here. So long. Fighting robots? Ha! <laughs> Me too. Oh, speaking of. What? Looks like you got a handle on things. You sound surprised. You're one surprise after another.
Almost in five years. Yeah, you too. Uh. Tony. Hang on, you're not leaving until you explain yourself. I'll be in touch. Thank you, promise. See you around, Avengers. Think you can trace her, Jarvis? Coordinates added to the war table. Avengers, good. There's someone who wants to talk to you. I believe some of you know Kate Bishop, formerly Hawkeye. Oh, we've met. <laughs> FYI, call me Katie and an arrow ends up in your eye. Tony, hey. Nuh-uh, if I can't call you Katie, there's no way you get to call me Tony. Old nicknames then? Iron Pants? Nuh-uh. Bucket Man? No. Tin Titan? Kinda like that one. Well, that takes the fun out of it. So you're working for S.H.I.E.L.D. now? It's, uh, complicated. Where's Clint? That's complicated, too. Agent Barton was captured by AIM a few years back. There's been very little intel since. Clint and I were looking into what happened to Director Fury after A-Day. Something didn't seem right about the story AIM was telling. Must have gotten too close. We stumbled on this Tachyon project, and then Clint was gone, too. It has to be connected. The Tachyon disruptions, Clint, Fury, everyone who gets close to these things disappears. But now we know there's one guy at the center of it all, Dr. Lyle Getz. We get him to spill his guts on the project, then we can go in and uh, shut it down. And you think we can convince him to flip? Convince, make him question all his life decisions. You know, we'll see how it goes. Simple, I like it. Ready when you are, Iron Pants. Hey, Kate, hang on a sec. Yeah, what's up? We're not gonna talk about this. You know we thought you were dead. Nobody heard from you. I tried contacting you in the early days. Nothing. You expected me to keep calling after five years? I, I know you guys probably had your reasons, but you made it pretty clear we were on our own. I thought it would be safer for you that way. Everyone who was there on A-Day was poison. A target. But things are different now. If you wanted to come back. We'll see. Hey, I uh, got a little something set up in the harm room for you. Uh, are you saying I need to practice? Because it sounds like you're saying I need to practice. No, no, I'm saying if you need to stay sharp or blow off some steam, get in some cardio. You know I'm just messing with you, right? Right. <laughs> Right. Is it weird that I missed it? No, don't answer that. It's weird. I know it's weird.
All right, surveillance footage shows this dude heading into the facility at like 5 a.m., no recorded exit, so he should still be here. Do we know anything else about this guy? Oh yeah, uh, Dr. Lau Getz, he specializes in robotics and particle physics and other nerd crap, joined AIM in the early days, and also, grade A creep. Glad that part of my report stayed on the record. While I was undercover, he started working on something top secret. I can never get clearance to find out what. Well, let's rifle through his sock drawer while we're here. Oh, I plan to. Okay, let's go find Getz. We'll have to get past security first. Not seeing a way for you to sneak through. They've got the area covered. It's gonna be a fight. You ready for this, Kate? Uh, I'm not the one who spent the last five years playing air guitar, my dude. Follow my lead. All right, let's get to higher ground. See if we can spot the fortress from here. I'm detecting a prisoner convoy up ahead. Prisoners? Must be headed for that fortress facility. Aim patrol, dead ahead. Aim patrol, dead ahead. Ooh, sounds like target practice. <sighs> Not for long. If Aim wants to make new friends, they'll just have to awkwardly socialize like the rest of us. Distract the guards. I'll get those cages open. You gotta punch the locks on the side to expose their weak points. It sounds like you've done this before. Once or twice? Once they're free, Theo can teleport them back to the anthill. Ooh, handy. Look for a chance containing special resources nearby. The best thing. inside the facility. Three scientists unaffiliated with AIM. Okay, let's resume our journey to the ominous prison fortress. You got some nice gadgets, Kate. They're not shield issue, but <laughs> I just happened to meet some AIM folk who just uh, happened to misplace their highly expensive equipment. Only took a few modifications. Convenient. Short range teleporter, invisibility cloak. They're surprisingly intuitive. All right, Even better than beating AIM with their own gear. I love violent girl talk. <sighs> Got eyes on the door. Now for some uh, casual breaking and entering. Oh, I am feeling it!
our grand entrance. I hope we match the dress code. Oh, haven't you heard? Tonight's dress code is aim in pain. <laughs> My god, that's awful. I love it. Catherine Elizabeth Bishop, daughter of Derek and Eleanor Bishop, private investigator and former Avenger. Oh, wait. They abandoned you before that ever became official, didn't they? Uh, stalker much? Can he hear us, Jarvis? Oh, we've got top surveillance on you, Avengers. Oh, good. That means I can tell you to butts off, intercom guy. Try not to die before I see you in the flesh, Ms. Bishop. <laughs> Dying. I'm too cute to die, baby. You're right. This gets guys a creep. Guess we lost the element of surprise. Nothing but resistance from this point onward. Oh, I'm counting on it. First we break the scientists out, then we find guests. Be a console somewhere. Yeah. Get these people out. Thank you. We didn't want to help them. They forced us. Hey, we you know. It's okay. What's Gets keeping you here for? Experimental robotics engineering. We mainly integrate this strange tech they got from uh, from somewhere. They don't know anything. You're wasting your time. <laughs> That's a safety. We'll have it. that Quinjet. We have room to spare, Miss Bishop. What are you planning, Kate? Oh, we're just gonna grab Dr. Getz and take him with us. There's no way I'm letting him go after this. You really are a Hawkeye. Lead the way.
Ready for extraction. Nice work, team. Let's drop him off at the substation. Maybe Maria can get some information out of him. Dr. Creep's about to spill some beans. Great. Now I'm hungry. So, Getz, how are you liking the accommodations? Uh, did you come here just to gloat? I did. But, mm. you know, we can cut to the chase if you want. Maria? Dr. Getz, we're well aware of your position in Ames' organization. If you're referring to my demotion, it's a jealous vendetta by that Rappuccini harpy. Ooh, so Monica's not happy with you either, huh? She didn't appreciate your little tachyon disaster, did she? I never mentioned Tachyon. Oh, come on, dude. The storms, massive radiation spikes. It's your work, isn't it? Was. My work was never this unstable. What Rappuccini's doing is reckless, suicidal. Now, get me a lawyer. Boop. Ooh, yeah, don't think so. It doesn't really matter, though. I already scanned your, uh... Facial structure. A little 3D hard light simulation in your security systems will think my Getz decoy is the real thing. I can see why Rappuccini was so interested in you. Your skills are impressive. What do you mean, interested? She's quite taken with both you and the other Hawkeye. It's a shame you chose the wrong side. Feeling like I made the right choice from here? You know, outside the prison cell? We're done. Guards. Don't let them get to you. These guys always try to mess with your head. Yeah, maybe, but I still need to look into this. 
If AIM was keeping tabs on Clint, I need to know what they have. Well, we can help. You guys made your priorities clear. Clint wasn't on the list. You know what, I get it. The Avengers have a world to save, you can't just drop everything. But I'm not giving up on my friend. I'll be back soon. Nice shot. Yeah, well, it's all in the breathing, and a bunch of other steps. I guess I know why you're here. Either I'm in trouble, or... We owe you an apology. We all made mistakes. And that meant we weren't there for you when you needed us most. Cap, you were taken prisoner. You've got nothing to apologize for. Yes, I do. I didn't prepare the team to go on without me. Also, I should have made this official a long time ago. You've proved you're an Avenger, Kate. If you'll have us. When I was a kid, I dreamed of hearing you say that. I also dreamed of flying a plane made of gumballs. I'm hoping that's a yes. Oh. Give it a shot. Yo, Dr. Pym. I hear you've got news about our tachyon situation? Yeah, the good kind. Thanks to your efforts, I've succeeded in locating the origin of the tachyon storms. These pockets of unstable time are all emanating from one central point. Ooh. Somewhere nice, I hope. Spain, Italy, <gasps> Wakanda. Not quite. We traced the disruptions to an AIM black site near a hydro dam in Siberia. Oh, mysterious. I like it. So if we shut down this facility, does that mean we'll stop all these time disruptions from happening? Tachyons are highly unstable. Let's see what we're dealing with first. All right. Recon it is. You, uh, sure you want me leading this, Cap? You know more about this situation than anyone. I trust you. And if you're ever not sure what to do, just listen to your instincts. They've served you well. That means a lot. Thanks, Cap. Let's do this. Hey, your work paid off, Avengers. I sent... We're approaching the Hydro Dam. You have a plan, Kate? I just figured we'd wing it. What? I'm joking, dude. Have a little faith. Okay, we take out the comm tower first, then sneak in and inspect their safety violations. Wow. Look at the sky. That can't be good. The tachyon disruptions are affecting the atmosphere. Okay, so uh, what am I looking at? Past and future sky? More like radiation trails. Oh, good. I feel much better about going outside now. Okay, where to first? There's a communications array nearby. If we can disable it, we'll have a short window where it will be gone and unable to call for backup. That? The closer you get to the origin point, the stronger the disruptions get. They're radiating out of that place like waves. There's the communications array. You let those guards call for backup, we're toast. I can jam the signal long enough for you to destroy the array. Just be quick. You got it, Doc.
tore down. Get to that aim facility. This is odd. Seems aim security is already on high alert. What? I thought we had to drop one. Uh, we do. They don't know you're here. Something else must have tripped their sensors. I'm spotting several aim patrols up ahead. They're blocking your path to the facility. Not for long. Secure. No sign of the others, Doctor. Looks like Monica's got other problems tonight. Yeah, someone put down that thing, and I'm pretty sure it wasn't in the uh, If you can clear them out, I'll be able to analyze the wreckage. Oh, it's my arm. I was downed recently. Looks like it was sent to intercept some escaped prisoners. Well, that explains the high alert. The facility is just over that ridge. All the tachyon readings originate from that location. That alert isn't going to make security any lighter. Maybe we can sneak in. You know, scale the roof and drop down. Another shockwave. That bunker's definitely responsible. Yep, security looks tight. Getting inside won't be easy. Jarvis and I can handle the door from here, but you'll need to clear the area. Got an arrow for you.
Find anything unusual in their system, Jarvis? I'm detecting highly concentrated energy signatures at the very bottom of the facility. Sounds like our tachyon target. I would be at the bottom. Whoa. Things are not okay in here. Jarvis, what are we dealing with? Pockets of abnormal gravity. These vents are connected to a room on the lower floor. I won't be able to break encryption. They're using actual keys. Well, you gotta respect the classics. Find me a target with access. We can take care of the rest. Not at all. Okay. There's an employee with the keys you need. <laughs> uh, you're up, Kate. The exosuit won't save me. I getting stronger you're on the right track okay this is it you ready no idea same 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 here we go hey uh what's with the busted robots Hurry. once we're through follow my lead we don't know what we're gonna find James, how's our signal all clear audio and visual connection is strong stays that way energy fluctuations in the room up ahead. Let's move. What the hell is that? Keep this quick. I want to keep potential paradoxes to a minimum. How's your progress on the weapon? We're close to a breakthrough. We should be able to send back a working prototype on our next connection. Excellent. Years of scientific progress in less than 30 days. Not for me. Patience. It'll be worth it. On that note, I have good news. Our guest finally agreed to help. Remember what's riding on this. Easy, Doc. Deal's a deal. I'll do my part. Clint? Kate, you need to destroy that place. 
Now! No. Fall back. Why didn't we destroy that thing when we had the chance? I don't know why the hell he'd be working with Monica, but I know Clint, okay? He has a reason, and we need to figure out what it is before we start wrecking things. Let's get to the anthill. This is bad. This is really bad. Hey, mind filling us in? Do you know what that thing was? It's a... well, basically it's a bridge through time. I've done research on the concept before, but until now, nobody's been foolish enough to actually try it. Okay, and that's the source of these tachyon disruptions? Whatever she's sending through time is, yes. And if we don't stop them, the storms will eventually tear reality apart. We're talking about time collapsing in on itself. They'll be locking down security after our break-in. But I have an idea. We're gonna build another time bridge. Did, did you not just hear me say, tearing reality apart? Messing with time is a bad idea. Exactly. So we are gonna fix it. We're gonna go get Clint out of the wrong timeline, cut Monica off from her future self. That would stop the storms, right? That's still messing with time. That's, that, that might work. I'll need a few things, but... You know what? Maybe. Okay. First, we'll need everything you can get on Monica's time bridge plans. Blueprints, records, everything. Shield's intel points to an AIM data center in Siberia. It's our best shot. So, what are the chances you can actually build this time bridge? Up until now, I thought it was impossible, but Monica seems to have cracked it somehow. Well, we're about to find out how. Better do this quietly. We don't want AIM interrupting us while we're pilfering their files. Into the cold we go. Again. If we're gonna break in without raising the alarm, we're gonna need to swipe some credentials. Can you find us a target? Intercepting AIM communications. Patrol Delta got lost in a snow squall. Waiting for them to regroup, then we'll head back. Hurry up. Dr. Rappuccini wants extra security in the data center. Found our sitting ducks. Perfect. Shall we? Patrol, dead ahead. Take them out before they can warn the others. Check their pockets while you're at it. This one's not getting back up.
doing okay, Kate? You seem a bit out of it. Yeah, sorry. I'm just thinking about what we saw. Clint working with Abe. I trust him. I just wish I knew what he was planning. None of this makes sense. Let's find those chattering Abe agents before they make it back to base. Abe agents, up in that tower. I think I can see an entrance to the center. There is a chest with gear close by. doing Jarvis ahead of you lies a forest go through it and you'll reach Ames data center I wonder how much they're hiding up here aim wants to stay in the public's good graces anything remotely controversial gets put out of the way I think time travel qualifies those blueprints have to be inside so does this thing have a name or is it just Time bridge. That's that's not a name. It's just what it is. A bridge through time. Sure, yeah, but I'm just saying, you could have named it like Get to the terminal quick. We don't want aim blocking those credentials. Yeah, no if we need those agents eat snow for nothing. What is though?
Sonic is using this time bridge for? I don't know. She mentioned years of scientific progress. She's accelerating something, passing it back and forth through time. That's the what that keeps me up at night. And how is Clint involved? Does she keeps secrets like that close. Okay, we grab what we can, then wipe their servers. Monica can't be allowed to make another one. Agreed. Let us know when you're ready. All right, we're in. Find the control hub. Jarvis should be able to access Ames' network and search for the plans. Strange. They're locked behind a firewall, but there are multiple records of an X element. I know that name. It was some mystery project we shut down in one of Monica's labs. I still don't know what it actually is. Oh, good, that's fun. Located. What do you need, Jarvis? The access point should be in the center of the room. The proximity hack should get me into the system, but you'll need to stay within its range. Hold position, stand ground. Better than this, Nowhere to hide. Wait, what are you talking about? Move it down. Jarvis, this data center is heavily secured. I'm afraid I'll need more time than anticipated. Don't worry, buddy. We'll hold them off. Receiving the blueprints now. Okay, we got what we needed. Let's get out of here. Right behind you. Everything you hoped for, Doc? This is exactly what we need. It's a long shot, but I should be able to recreate it. My people can get almost everything I need to build our own bridge, but powering it is another story. How do you manage to get the entry off of schedule, nice. 
I got your call. I know Director Fury stockpiled Cabarite in many of our shield bunkers across the world. Normally, I'm not the one to gamble shield assets on a hunch. But saving Hawkeye would win us another veteran in our war against AIM. I already put Dugan on the case. From what I've heard, he should have everything ready by now. out. Don't see what the problem is. Yes, sir. So you need Cavarite, huh? I might have heard where there's some stashed. Uh, sorry, one sec. Uh, confession time. I've only been pretending to know what Cavarite is. Yeah, it's a kind of volatile element. Packs a punch. We used it to power some of uh, S.H.I.E.L.D.'s experimental tech back in the day. Can't use dogs to sniff it out, so I updated your signal tracker. I'll mark the spot on the ward table for you. Good luck out there. Okay, Hank said we'll need a ton of Cavarite if we want to power our own time bridge. Fury stashed plenty in old shield bunkers. Man was a hoarder. Old documents reveal the presence of a shield bunker near an old satellite farm in Siberia. God, man, it's never Hawaii, is it? All right, let's go. AIM has repurposed this satellite farm to bolster their communications across Siberia. Unfortunately for us, it's also interfering with our signal detector, blocking us from locating the nearby shield cache. Well, we're gonna need to shut down whatever's jamming us before we can find that cab, right? Let's get to it, gang. The first satellite dish is just up ahead. I've marked a waypoint so you can tell the difference. Yep, that's uh, a lot of satellite dishes. Thanks for the pointer, guys. You're at the interference site. Destroy AIM's equipment and it should disrupt their signal jamming. and shut it down. Hi, you hit? You're still out them. I've seen these before. There's an automatic reset timer, so we're gonna have to take the modules out quickly.
disabled. Excellent work. Uh, that should do it. How's it looking, Bishop? And the signal detector is up and running. Let's find Fury's secret cache. Fury sure had a field day hiding these caches. An ice cave? Seriously? Yeah, he always figured. We're super spies. Let's own it. So, uh, what exactly was this cavrite used for? You know, besides building time bridges that could blow up the world? Not sure, kid. Nick was always tight-lipped about Cavorite. Used to glare at you with his good eye whenever it got mentioned. So secret and dangerous, huh? Yeah. And now Ames got their grubby hands on it. One hell of a headache. There's a chest with gear close by. Here we are. Okay. 
authentication complete. Please resume code authentication at the vault. sent us coordinates. Should be on the war table already.
see you in a few. I'll send Theo to meet you outside. We had to build the bridge in a separate location. It's too dangerous to have near the anthill, let alone inside it. Thanks for the portal, Theo. Welcome to our little remote hideout. Dr. Pimp's just up ahead. All right, Hank, we're inside. Everything up and running? Oh, you're in for a treat. See you in a bit. Welcome back. You've gathered enough Cavrite to power the bridge. You have one shot at this. Great, let's go get Hawkeye. Whoa! Our best shot is to go back a day before he entered Monica's time bridge. You'll need to intercept him before he goes through. After that, we'll have no idea where to find him. Will that be enough time to get there? Monica's lab is all the way in Siberia. Well, that's the fun new experimental part. I'm connecting you to Monica's bridge. When you step through, you'll come out on the other side in her lab. In the past. Time and space? I wanted it to be a surprise. Also, it might not work. But if it does, we can stop Clint and destroy the bridge. That should repair whatever damage Monica's done. I'm gonna go ahead and ignore the might not work part. Nice choice. Do your best not to disrupt the timeline outside of wrecking the bridge. That's risky enough, but what Monica's doing is worse. Ooh, okay, uh, I have so many questions. Um, but I like the energy, so let's just turn this thing on before I overthink it. Right. Jarvis will be with you the whole time. Just get Clint, destroy the bridge, and get out. I guess we're jumping back to the past. Well, there goes nothing. Jarvis, did we time travel or just, uh, teleport? My internal clock differs from the local time, so yes, we have succeeded. But we're only an hour ahead of our past self. What? Instead of transporting you a day before Clint's arrival, you have arrived an hour before- No, I get it, Jarvis. Oh, crap. We have to move. Ah! Hey guys, uh, just passing through. Jarvis, do you have eyes on Clint? Scanning the area. There's a large convoy approaching the facility. Dr. Rappuccini is scheduled to meet it on arrival. That must be Clint. Any way to get a message to him? I can try, but you'll need to get me closer. Okay, we don't have a lot of time. Just guide me to it. It's really gonna suck if this is like their laundry truck. Well, this place looks familiar. I'm picking up the convoy ahead. We'll have to get Clint out of there before it reaches the facility. Oh, looks like we found a welcome party. Didn't I already wipe the floor with you guys? They've split up the prisoners. Something about a security breach. Uh, let's get this cell open. Whatever Monica has to do, prisoners can't be good. Jarvis, give me the up. Kate? Wait, wait a minute. What frequency are you on? I thought you were talking to Pim on the other line. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'll explain later. Much later. And, uh, I called you. We just need to get these prisoners to safety. Fine. But only because I own them. A bigger convoy lies up ahead. Follow the ridge and you'll reach it. <laughs> There's a chest with gear close by. I'm not detecting Mr. Barton at this location. Charm. Let's do this. Got eyes on the enemy. Hi. Any chance you guys are just gonna let me all day? Nope. Nope. You know what? I'm just gonna take you out of the do it anyway. Open. Katie? Oh my god. What are you doing here? Saving you, dummy. You don't understand. I agreed to this. What? Has sent their forces to recapture the prisoners. Uh, look, explain on the way. We gotta move. How could you work with AIM? Remember that day we got separated? We were right about Fury. AIM had him locked up. Same as me. So he's alive? Yes. Turns out Fury and I both found plans for something called Project Omega. Monica claimed she was trying to stop an apocalypse. And you believed her? Fury did, or pretended to. We were her prisoners, but he agreed to help her. Then, after a while, I got a message. He needed my help, and Monica wanted me to go in after him. So this is a rescue mission. Great minds think alike. Crap. Blocking the way. Let's take this thing down and get out of here. Uh, I can't go with you, Kate. Have to. We're destroying the bridge. Whatever Monica's doing is tearing apart reality. Or did you not notice? Yeah, that part complicates things. You think? I hate you.
Crystal Mega must be caught in these tachyon storms. AIM has been using time travel to speed the process up. It's a weapon strong enough to fight the apocalypse. That's what it's supposed to do. Sorry, I, I have to go. You better come back, all right? I'll try, but if I don't... Nope, not having that conversation. Okay, so just get back to the convoy before Monica realizes you're gone. Let's get to the bridge. Jarvis? 
Aliens send their forces to recapture the prisoner. Again? Tachyon pulses. My readings are good. Disruptions are messing with time now. It's getting worse. Stay with me, buddy. Another wave's coming. Let's find cover. Right away. I know you don't want to hear this, but if Clint can't make it through in time... We destroy the bridge. I know. I'm sorry, Kate. It won't come to that. Right. But if it does... I can do it. All right. Let's shut this vomit machine down for good. Get us control. Once it's open, expose the power cells while we give Clint a chance to come through. You'll need to approach the time bridge so I can initiate a proximity override. Okay. Jarvis will deal with security while I get the bridge open. Okay. We're doing this. you enough time to get control of the bridge? I'll work with whatever you can get us. Not exactly yes, but I'll take it. Why do I feel like we're in safe distance? You've delayed. 
beneath the security protocols, but the system is adapted. Stay near the bridge while I attempt an override. Dr. Pym, status? Working on it.
Avengers fan. The shield, the hammer. I'm gonna guess you've got some rockets hiding back there. Kate, AIM has control of the bridge. We can't open it again unless we get it back. Please just hang on! <laughs> Nice work, Kate. Uh, thanks for waiting for me. Thanks for coming back. I have to tell you what I saw. Ah, but no, no, no. Ah, ah. Do it back at the Chimera, okay? Because I don't know about you guys, but I need a nice strong coffee if we're going to talk time trap. I'm really proud of you, Kate. Ah, uh, please don't. I mean it. Now, I get partial credit, of course, but... You're in your element here. 
You were always meant to be an Avenger. Yeah, I, uh, I wasn't sure for a while. But even after everything we've been through, mistakes we've made. This is the stupid, messed up family I want to fight for. Does that mean you're staying? Yeah, I'm staying, man. Okay? And sorry, but you're not getting your room back. I am more than okay with the couch. Unless that's a couch. Is that the couch? Welcome to the fight, old friend. It's good to have you back. <laughs> yeah, could say the same to you. Still can't believe you're alive and kicking. You're damn hard to kill, Cap. Glad you're here, buddy. Now people can finally stop asking where Hawkeye went. What Tony's trying to say is... We really missed you, Clint. Sappy, but true. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Huh. Really took care of things while I was gone, huh? Of course. But tell us of the future, Barton. What perils lie ahead of us? Yeah, that's uh, a lot to take in. So, bear with me here. Wait a sec. That's the robot we fought in San Francisco. The one controlled by MODOK. It's extraterrestrial. In the future, we get attacked by a warrior race called the Kree. And an invasion that'll end the world as we know it. Now, Monica... Uh, future Monica is working with Nick Fury to save the Earth. She's building some sort of weapon. She she ran out of time in the future, so she's she's tried bringing it to the past to finish it. Which explains all our tachyon-related trouble. When will this Kree invasion take place, Clint? No idea. I don't know when they're coming, or even why, but I, I know we're horribly outgunned unless we do something. Right, Fury? He convinced Monica to send me to the future to help him, but when I got there, well, he told me we're losing the war. He said, I have to come back and warn you. Look, we all need to start preparing right now. And we will. Tell us where to start, and we'll get right to it. Right, well, we can, uh, you know, I... Oh, no. Clint? Clint! <sighs> Bruce! Get the medics, quickly! Come on. Stay with me. Stay with me, Clint. Look at me, Barton. Clint? I thought we got rid of those tachyon storms. Now they seem like they're following us. I've got Clint's harm exercise back online. Helps to keep busy. You can access it now if you want. Sorry, just trying to focus. I've almost got this figured out, I think. Ah, uh, should have worn a 
face mask. Hard to tell this is once a battlefield. Even shield tanks never stood a chance. Man, I miss my car. Especially the AC. Why is an aimbot broadcasting on an old shield frequency? Doesn't make sense. There's that signal again. Something weird's going on. during the invasion. My AI was spread across multiple resistance units. I am perfectly operation. Shim, shim, shim. And then, perfectly. No fixing him. Ah, wiring's fried.
that signal. This way. Signal's close. <sighs> Real close. Glad you died with the rest of them. You ugly bastard. Oh, give me a break. Come <laughs> on. 
was right. Fashion stuff opens all kinds of doors. Glad nobody heard that. I've been spending too much time alone. Signal's getting stronger. There you are. Hang on. Hello, world. Hey, you have to stay awake this time, okay? Of course. I have a message for you, Avenger Clint. To any surviving Avengers, should we lose the fight ahead of us? Should everything be lost? Then know this. The key to saving our future lies in the past. Um, one, uh, weird. Two, that's it? A cryptic message? There's more. He wanted you to enter the cave and see, 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 see. No. Uh, wake up. I'm not going back to talking to dirt. expected this to go. Typical Fury. Gotta act all covert, even in the apocalypse. Whatever's in this cave, Fury wanted me to see it. This looks like Pym's work. It is. That's... That's a time bridge. Correct. It is no longer fully functional, but I can transmit a signal through it. You will need to restore power. Up there. The key to the future lies in the past. Huh. Smart. Time to fix you up. do it. Does everything hurt? You had us worried. Mm. Mm. Almost worth it to hear you admit you worry about anything. How long was I out? Too long for comfort. Bruce spent a lot of time keeping you stable. Uh, uh, I love that nerd. You know, I had the weirdest dream. Clint? Katie, hey. Ow! I don't think the docs would approve. Oh, I'm gone for one minute and you decide to wake up? I'm, I'm sorry? Yeah, you should be. You need anything else, Clint? Yeah. Uh, someone find my pants. Something I gotta do.
Spartans, hi. Good to see you, Bart. Hawkeye back from the dead. How you feeling? Like a zombie. A handsome zombie with great hair. He's obviously delusional. Right. As you may remember, I was working with Nick Fury to save the future. And he was working with Monica, right? Uh, will be? Ding, ding, ding. Points to you, kid. Now, before that, we both stumbled on AIM's super secret tachyon research, and I oh, managed to get away with some of it before they caught up to me. Project Omega. Retrieving this package sounds like our best course of action. Where is it now? <clears throat> that would be Brooklyn. Uh, please don't tell me you left it in your apartment. I have someone watching it, okay? Well, he's watching the dog, technically, but... Let's go, Barton. Well, okay, hey, hey, you're, you're gonna be embarrassed when you see how well I hit it. heading back home. <sighs> Weird. Time hangover doesn't help. I'm not completely sure how long I've been gone. What day it is. Well, to be fair, that's not unusual for you. Oh, I've missed you. Missed you too, buddy. <sighs> oh, okay, drop us off here, Jarvis. Don't want to draw too much attention. Right. Aim's still patrolling the streets. Let's try to avoid a Hawkeye reunion tour, huh? Apartment's just up ahead. Staying on rooftop should keep us off Aim's radar. <laughs> Drones, those are uh, new since you've been, uh, well, uh... Monica's prisoner? I was gonna say reluctant accomplice, but okay. I was helping Fury, or, I don't know, trying to. That dream I had was real. So I failed at that too. Dude, you're blaming yourself for dream failures now? I guess you're right. There are enough real ones to blame myself for after all. Let's just keep moving. Rooftop barbecue. It really takes me back. Hey, Gil! Hey, Hawkeye! Long time. Good to see you. How's my dog doing? Lucky's great. I love that dog. Uh, but wait, did, didn't you move out today? What? No. What makes you say that? Well, I saw a bunch of guys hauling stuff from your apartment. What? They said they were movers. Uh, Linton Francis Barton. What great timing. Do I know you? Watchdogs. Ames hired guns. Surrender quietly. Or die noisily. You thinking what I'm thinking? This goon squad is going to... Here it comes. 
One down. Who's next? safe? Yeah, thanks. We're good. Okay, stay put. I'll take care of this. Yeah, you will. <laughs> Show them what happens when you mess with Brooklyn. Watchdogs are heading to the garage. Let's take the elevator. Catch them by surprise. up about this? Uh, I don't know why I'm kidding, still trying to be an Avenger. Maybe I'm... Just make it any worse. Look, I can't believe I'm saying this, but criticizing yourself isn't gonna help right now. Okay? We need you to focus. I can multitask, thank you very much. Hey, watch up. Hands up, weapons down. <laughs> you don't scare us. Yeah, you should be scared of me. That would have worked better if you had said, we're not scared of you. No. Let's take it from the top. Hey, maybe we can get the baby got explosives. Hey, you still got a bomb, Eagle? Yeah, I'm still good at everything. You got this, dude. Lots to get Dog? Ah. They're moving down the street. You gotta hurry. Nobody messes with my dog. More watchdogs up ahead. Not for long. Hey, which one of you has my dog? Give up 
Gil, I need an update. AIM has a checkpoint further down the road. We gotta move. Mobile prison cell? Hey! Over here! Gil! <laughs> Not on my watch. Get these folks out of here. Come on. Get somewhere safe. We've got a truck to catch. Stop the truck! Stop the truck! Oh no! Lucky, I swear to God. Huh. you buddy it's all right you're okay now you poor guy okay i'm gonna refrain from comparing reunions to point out they got away with your data man not all of it huh sneaky how unlike you oh couldn't fit much on this but it's better than nothing 
I guess maybe your master isn't as dumb as he looks. And he looks pretty dumb, doesn't he? Yeah. Okay, Lucky. You stay safe at the Chimera. Good doggo. Huh. Sounds like you had a rough night. I knew Monica would come after me, but... <sighs> Involving civilians? This SIM card. What's on it? Not sure. Couldn't read it. It's, uh... AIM data encryption. I could take a look. We are currently at substation zero. Huh. How, uh, cozy. <clears throat> All right, meet you at the substation. You're not, you're not doing so well, are you, Clint? How do you figure? You never ask for help. From anyone, really. Fair enough. I analyzed the SIM card you recovered. It was... a lot to take in. Good news? Please give me some good news, Doc. Does cosmic energy ring a bell at all? <laughs> Aim's messing with cosmic energy. <laughs> you don't even know what that is, do you? I mean, you know, it's, it's energy. That's... Cosmic, so no, no, I, I don't. It has the power to change reality. While Tachyon alters time, cosmic energy alters everything. Not surprising, one led to the other. Speaking of Tachyon, we detected an active time bridge transmission originating somewhere in the distant future. Yeah, I uh, saw that in that vision I told you about. If everything you saw is true, the end of the world is far closer than we'd like. Okay, we need a plan. We, we need fury. Can we use your time bridge to reach the future? Not safely. I'd rather not expose you to more Tachyon if I could help it. But I could modify the Quinjet to carry a team through. We've established a direct connection to the future time bridge. I've made the necessary modifications. So we can go to the future now. Find Fury. If it all works, everything's prepared. Check the war table when you're ready. We're too sure. Hey, have I ever told you how great you are? Access granted. So, uh, what's your plan? I left Yuri in the future when I jumped back through the time bridge. If he's alive, I'm getting him out. Then we can use this Project Omega Intel to stop the end of the world. And if he isn't? Kate, Kate, Kate. Nick Fury's contingency plans have contingency plans. That man can survive the apocalypse. Fair enough. Let's find him. We made it. 
Nice work, Pim. Uh, yikes. It looks pretty grim out there. Yeah, it's definitely not one of those fun apocalypses. is the future. Great. Is anything like that dream of yours? Yeah. It definitely wasn't just a dream. I've been here before. Clint, you never left that bed on the Chimera. Yeah, yeah, I, I know. Not physically, but it feels like I know this place. And I gotta follow this road. After you, Dorothy. Of rocks. Great. Uh, just our luck. Guess we're taking a detour. <sighs> I almost feel bad for them. Apocalypse? Not sure, but let's get rid of these guys before they tell some more. Here. Power is no problem! First guess, we failed to save the world? Uh, I'm you for the most depressing answer possible. <clears throat> yeah, well, pretty sure it's true. Let's show them how to throw it. Crashing a gas station. I don't know. Let's find out, shall we? Challenge accepted. Look for anything useful. Come on.
Pretty fresh too. Hmm. Robots must have followed whoever did this. Can anyone hear me? Aim's on my tail. Who's this? Wh where are you? Bots got me pinned by the truck near the road. Okay, hang in there. We're on our way. He's broadcasting on a shield frequency. Which means we're not alone. Okay, let's find him. That's it. The Avengers? Am I dead? Yeah. Not quite. We got it. That's it. Aim's taken care of. Are you all right? Yeah, thanks. The old's had me. I can't believe it's you. Okay, maybe you can help us out. Your shield, right? We're looking for Commander Fury. You and everyone else around here. Okay, explain. Hold him off as long as you can. We got this. Now, I don't know where he is. My team was looking for him, too. We got separated. They're just past the arch to your right. Then we'll tell you everything we know. Guess the invasion didn't kill everyone. Huh. Maybe we'll finally get some answers. Yeah. Let's hurry before there's no one left to talk to. in there. We're on our way. Uh, that voice! Hawkeye? In the flesh. We got your back. Personal space! I call this is target of the
where these mercenaries find our base. A patrol was spotted moving across the highway. Mercenaries? Servants of the Supreme Leader. Uh, Supreme who? <laughs> the Supreme Leader's a mystery. All we know is they control the majority of the American wastelands. This part included. They catch us, we're all dead. It's not an apocalypse without some wannabe dictator. down the road. You'll find what you're looking for there. How do you all know I'm looking for fury? You'll see. How can people live in a world like this? I know. Hard to call it living. More like surviving. Yeah. Let's find that hideout. Make sure those people are safe. Creep you out a little? They just happen to be looking for Fury too? When it comes to Fury, nothing surprises me, but yeah, it creeps me out a lot. Okay, what ends here? Let's take a look around. from the radio. Welcome, welcome. Hi, we are looking for Fury. Some of your friends said you uh, might be able to help? The boss is looking for him too. He said someone was coming to help. I guess that's you. You might want to check out the board over there. Um, thanks. something. an ugly washed up shield agent in the future too. Mm, nice to know some things never change. <laughs> Ah, come on, you're leaving already? 
already? <laughs> and the rats run out of their hole. You're making this far too easy. Yeah, should have known you survive. yourself. I would say the same. How is it the powerless Avengers survive this long? Did you cower and hide while your friends died on the battlefield? You say it like someone who did. In that shirt. Katie? You're alive. Clint? Damn, I got old and ugly. You didn't get ugly, punk. Well, I guess that explains the shock arrow and the bow. And the repressive sea of emotions. Uh, I missed you. <laughs> missed me? Wait. Wait a second. What did you mean with you're alive? Am I... Yeah. We, uh... We couldn't stop the invasion. You... Everyone's just been dead for decades. Cool. I guess the dystopian future wasn't depressing enough already. Yeah, well, we're here to stop it. So, where do we start? Let's get back to the hideout, punk. This SIM card is a godsend. We know Fury got involved in Project Omega right before the war. I'm sure this data can help us track him down. How long have you been looking for him? <sighs> Since it all went to hell. I'd retired just like we planned, then Fury came looking for me. Wanted me to help him fight the coming war. Wait, retired? When? Uh, after we resolve all this business with Project Omega, I, I was, I was, I was, I was going to tell you. All right, I. If it helps. Didn't go well when I told her either. I cannot believe. You're leaving us. You or left or whatever. I mean, but you came back, right? To help us fight the Kree? I didn't. Told Fury that I was washed up. That you didn't need me. Of course we need you! Look, I won't try to justify it now. It's one of a long line of mistakes. Since the war, I've been searching for Fury. To see if I can make it up to him. So, uh, what's our plan here? We've pinned a location from the data you brought us. Substation 99. Possibly Fury's last known location. There's only one way to be sure. Fine, let's get moving. Kate! We'll talk about it when this is over. If we figure out where Fury was right before the invasion, you think we can find him? That's the general idea. And... What if he's... No. I can feel it in my gut. Fury is out there. <sighs> Seems like following our gut hasn't paid off too well so far. But I don't have a better idea, so... Where are we headed, old-timer? An abandoned shield bunker. 
We sent a drone to scout ahead, but we lost the signal. Abandoned? So no one trying to kill us, right? Uh, not exactly. The bunker is deep in Supreme Leader territory. You're in for a fight. It's always gotta be the hard way. Well, if there's any clue to Nick Fury's location, this shield bunker is where it'll be. The Supreme Leader owns this area, so heads up for mercenaries. We can handle some mercenaries. I didn't say some. The Supreme Leader has an army. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Just find that shield bunker, kid. Hey, uh, uh old Clint. Uh, the Supreme Leader is the one who hired Taskmaster, right? <sighs> the Supreme Leader rules through strength and fear. I don't think Taskmaster had much of a choice. Oh, my heart bleeds for him. No sign of mercenaries yet. Let's keep it that way. <sighs> Looks like we found your drone. How did it crash? Well, let's check it out. Glass marks. This thing got shot down. Stay on guard. Hostiles could be anywhere. Hostiles in sight. Heads up. Enemy spotted. You know what to do. still works. Let's find that shield bunker. We're not alone here.
You didn't know this shield bunker was here? And all the old signal detectors got destroyed. Good thing you broke yours. All for me? Aww. Get close. Let's look around. Get back to the Quinjet. Come on! Don't you die on me, old man!
Peachy. Quinjet's ready and waiting for you. Find anything interesting in those shield files? Report. Yes. Director Fury was planning to collaborate with AIM at a refurbished shield cache known as Substation 99. Any idea where to find this place? Not yet. I'll sort through my data banks. Maybe I can triangulate a location. <sighs> Good luck. Everything checks out, we're on our way to Nick Fury's last known location. Shield Substation 99. Problem is, the cache is in the middle of Supreme Leader territory. And they really don't seem to like the idea of us finding Fury. Why do you think they're trying to stop us? Mm, beats me. All I know is they're gonna fail. <laughs> Miserably. Wow, well said, me. Storm's preventing us from getting closer, so this will have to do. Substation 99, here we come. You seem to be enjoying yourself. You trying to make me change my mind about retiring? Oh, I'm in complete denial about that. That sandstorm looks even more brutal from down here. You just focus on finding Fury, kid. I'll make sure no one gets the drop on us. Well, this won't take long. Supreme Leader's got eyes everywhere. Watch your backs. Movement up ahead. Mercenaries. How do you see them, but I don't? Well, not blind just yet. Open people. I'm receiving a very faint distress signal. It's on a shield frequency. Wait, shield? Could it be Fury? Oh my god. You seeing what I'm seeing? Is that the Chimera? Yes. This is where the Avengers fell. Most of them. I 
I should have been there. Clint, don't. She's right. I'm gonna fix this nonsense. All of it. You having any luck, old man? No life in this place. Just more derelict dame bots. Right. Keep you posted. Keep your eyes open, baby bird. Surprises are everywhere. Another patrol. This place is crawling with mercenaries. Well, that can't be a coincidence, right? Is that a giant head? It's not a great shield to me. Everyone we fight thinks of the king of the world. Screw it. Let's go. Somebody's trying to make a point. They're doing a pretty good job. Yeah, I'm uh, almost hoping Fury's not being kept here. <sighs> yeah. You and me both. The young hog finally arrives. Welcome to the end of the world. Holy crap, Bruce. Puny Banner died a long time ago. There's only the maestro now. Uh-huh. Right. Okay, look. I'm not trying to mess with your maestro wing. I'm, I'm here for fury. I'm not the stupid brute you remember. I know why you're here. To take away my power. You know why I'm still here. Because 
I'm the strongest there is. You better appreciate this fury.
isn't working. Here, gamma arrow. What the hell happened to you? I survived. I've only got one thing to say to you. Where's Nick Fury? So, you never ventured beyond the storm. You coward. We unleashed forces we didn't understand. We thought we were heroes. Beyond the storm, is it safe? Let's find out, shall we? These years, Fury, you were here all along. Monica, in, in her hand, is that Project Omega? Her world saving weapon was a cosmic containment unit, the Cosmic Cube. So she failed. It didn't stop the invasion. It just froze them in time while the world was destroyed around them. We failed. All of us. But listen. You don't have to make the mistakes that I did. Don't give up on the Avengers. They do need you. Trust me. What? What are you talking about? It took me too long to figure that out. So you do it for me. Okay, I'll stop this. I promise. I don't doubt it. Now you better get back to your own time. I'll see you again someday, Junior. Still thinking of retiring, Clint? <laughs> Hell no. Whatever I did in that timeline, I'm doing the opposite. Facial hair? Never. We clear? Clear. Let me seek the next charge.
no, 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 Beloved, you let him go? Yes, Okoye. For now. Won't he warn the others? And still they will be at a disadvantage. He will lead me to his friends, then to their leader, Claw. lesson. Searching it for intel. Should I tell Princess Shuri? She will receive the after action report. Plans for some kind of sonic cannon. Claw is targeting the shield around the city. I need to get that first. Was that the tunnel to Benning Zana? I am going there now. Thank <laughs> you. 
can bring a jet plane to get over the collapsed tunnel. No. Send your forces to the shield. That is where close men will be headed. I know another way. Huh. A way you have not shared with the Dora Milaje? I am sharing it with you now. Somewhat begrudgingly. You will enjoy this, Okoye. Huh. Okoye, the corrupted vibranium has spread to this part of the jungle too. How is it moving so quickly? I do not know yet. It must be destroyed. Pacified. Time to open my shortcut. That never gets old. I will admit it. That was very nice. Hmm. It is not every day I earn praise from the leader of the Dore Milaje. She does. All potential Black Panthers do. I have not seen this cave since I was training with my uncle. Like stepping into a memory. I remember breaking this looking for a way in. Explosives were not a good idea. Reaping the souls of Wakanda's invaders. She protects us always. A 
Not just clear Ulysses Claude fancies himself a technologist, a sonic cannon. Perhaps the one thing capable of taking down Wakanda shields. I have underestimated the length to which he will go to obtain vibranium. I remember when they modernized the technology behind this tram. Uncle was vehement that it still look the same as it did a thousand years ago. What in Boss name? This was not dug, but cut. Some kind of sharp metal drill? Perspective like Panthers. Ah, to see it defiled in this way. Claw and his minions must be stopped. Bashenga wanted every new Black Panther to remember why he received the title. Ten thousand years ago, the tribes of Wakanda were at war. The meteor carrying vibranium crashed to Earth. That meteor became the vibranium mound that overlooks the Golden City. Inside the mound grew the heart shaped herb, a gift from Bast herself. Just wait on outside 
Hunters doing in Wakandan airspace? I test them in. Those men made it to the city border and you are not here. I will deal with the Avengers later. First, I must take Claw Sonic Cannon offline. and the Avengers keep Claw's men busy. Draw their attention away from the cliffside. There won't be a problem. But if that shield comes down, they can help you. Stop him! He can't get you the cannon! I have it handled, sister. We don't have much time before they are through the shield. I must hurry! Wasn't exaggerating. Yeah. Hey, Panther Boy. What now? Now you introduce yourself. Crossbones at your service. You want this to hurt more? Or way more. Are you always this spoken? 
No, darling. I pulled out all the stops for the kid king. Strange choice for your last words, Colossus. <laughs> This is hilarious! <laughs> down and your hands up. We're here to see King T'Challa. Good. Because he wants to see you too. Uh-oh. King T'Challa, Princess Shuri, we didn't know AIM was following us. If we had... Do you know why AIM has taken a sudden interest in my country? It likely has something to do with us stealing a very powerful weapon of theirs. And destroying another one. I see. If it is any comfort, you did not lead advanced idea mechanics to our doorstep. We've been swatting them like flies for weeks. So you know about the corrupted vibranium. What it can do to things. And people. We are working on a treatment for those affected by it. And are narrowing down its source, but... How do you know about it? Because we've seen it outside of Wakanda. That's not good? Mm. This means Ulysses Claw is doing more damage than we anticipated. He's the head of AIM operations here. From the information we've gathered, he's deeply entrenched in the black market vibranium trade, like his father was. You're not concerned? Only by his sonically based technology. It disrupts anything made of or powered by vibranium, including our shields and scanners. But AIM will not be cloaked forever. I can promise you that. We believe that technology has something to do with the corruption. And we made it just in time. Ah, to offer help. To ask for yours. Now that we know AIM's involved, we can give you information, if you need it. But Vibranium is your specialty. Map the locations of corrupted Vibranium outside of Wakanda. 
We need to know how far it has spread and plan a dispersal method for medical treatments. I'm on it. Have a look around. You can see what we are already doing to fight Claw and Aim. And hopefully make ourselves useful. Captain Rogers, can you meet me in my lab? You will find it to your right. I'm on my way. Princess Shuri. Tony. There you are. You mentioned you would be willing to share some information. Whatever you need. Wakanda will have access to all resistance intel. Thank you. Now, I am surprised the corrupted vibranium has spread so far beyond our borders. We will need to contain the damage Claw has done. You got eyes on him? Ooh, ooh. Tell him about the Kimoyo network. Kimoyo? This is the Kimoyo network. Well. Part of it. In cap speak, it's the internet, but better. Much better. The Kimoyo network provides our people access to all of Wakanda's collected knowledge. We use it for communication, transportation, and a great many other things. All thanks to our Kimoyo beads. And she won't let us have one. Citizens only. We have been using the network to keep track of Claw's movements. He is quiet for now, but if he makes any noise, our warriors will find him. Well, I don't doubt it. Thank you for the data, Captain. And when you get a moment, there is someone else who wants to meet you. If the other guest could come down, down, down to my chambers, I would appreciate it. Follow the smoke. <laughs> huh. Oh, that's new. I do not know why you insist on coming to my Yes, yes, we heard you the first time to drop her. You feel forgotten. I can't imagine how. Is they named the city after you? Oh, pipe down, I have a guest. Ah, Steve Rogers, the captain of America. I am honored we can finally meet face to face. King Azuri always spoke fondly of his encounter with the American Iceman. The feeling's mutual. You may call me Zawavari. I am the mystical advisor to the Wakandan royal family. May I ask you a favor, Captain? Always. The young king seems to trust you. Do not make him regret that decision. I won't take our position lightly. I promise. In return, a secret. The guards have far more to do with Wakanda's impressive technology than you might guess. A sneaks, the princess's uh, assistant, uh, uh, minion. <laughs> I will tell him I sent you. Your guidance is appreciated. And may the Orisha guide you as well, Captain. Zaravari, your communication bead is still functioning on your Kamoyo bracelet, right? Because sending people messages inside their head is unsettling. Oh, oh, they are here. Shh. This is quite the workstation. Combat research and development, all of which is now available to you as well. You may thank Princess Shuri for that. I will. You working on anything interesting? Take a look. Zawavari has been helping me uncover the more mystical properties of Vibranium. Perhaps you'll reap the benefits, should you prove yourself a worthy ally of Wakanda. That's a lot to live up to. Follow our king, and all will be well. <laughs> it's nice meeting you, Nix. Steve, we need you in the war room upstairs. Something wrong? Captain Okoye wants to brief us. Something about malfunctioning security systems. Hmm. I'll be there ASAP.
Captain Okoye, what seems to be the problem? King T'Challa has a request. Our scouts have reported Claw is mobilizing his forces throughout Wakanda with remarkable ease. We believe Claw's found a blind spot in Wakanda's security systems. Okoye will investigate and will reinforce if necessary. Claw does seem to know what he's doing. Many have tried to conquer Wakanda, to rob us of our heritage. As you can see, they have all failed. And so will Claw. We'll help you however we can. Good. You have permission to use our wall table. Let's put that vibranium of yours to good use. Thank you, Okoye. Honest. You just wanted to show off this suit. As usual, I have no idea what you're talking about. I recognize the Avengers as allies of Wakanda. Thank you. I hope we do you justice. You will have to get used to keeping up with me. That's my brother's version of a warm welcome. You will also have to get used to that. You finally agree to accept help, and it is from outsiders. That is not like you. I am not accepting help. I am giving it. Then let me send teams to the corrupted sites. Take the Dora Milaje with you when you confront AIM. Do something other than driving yourself headfirst into danger. I am not just a king on a throne. I am the Black Panther. Then show us. You can be both. I will. Avengers, I hope you have familiarized yourselves with the palace by now. Your people have been most welcoming. I'd like to see more of Wakanda once Claw's been dealt with. <laughs> You're such a tourist. A tourist? In Asgard, we call that adventuring. It's an emergency transmission. This is Okoye. We are being pushed back. We need assistance. You cannot handle close forces alone. It's not just Claw. He has turned our defense systems against us. Impossible. We've lost her signal. If Claw has broken the Kimoyo encryption, something is very wrong. Then I think it is about time the Avengers see what the Black Panther is truly capable of. It would be an honor to tag along. Move fast. I do not like the idea of Claw hacking our technology. Sister, any news of Okoye? She's still unresponsive. Okoye can handle herself, right? The Dora Milaje are the finest warriors in Wakanda. But even they can be surprised. Let's hope for the best. Okoye's last transmission originated nearby. We will find her. If our defenses are truly compromised, it will be a dangerous trek through the jungle. No matter. I welcome the challenge. I'm detecting heat signatures up ahead. Human and robotic in origin. We will catch them by surprise.
Shuri seems worried about you. Shuri has been overprotective since our father died. I can hear both of you. Melage called the Panther. Join us, Avengers. Wakanda forever. These turrets back upon us. Destroy them. We can rebuild them later.
nuisance. Not just a nuisance, a legitimate security threat. I'm receiving another distress signal. A tower has been hacked near the border. Okoye, clean up Straglass. The Avengers and I will secure the other tower. At once. There is a cavern pass we can use to reach the other tower. This claw is no run of the mill goon. He will pay for his transgressions. If they can't get into the Vibranium Mount, what is AIM trying to do out here in the forest? Vibranium ley lines stretch outward from the mound itself, most concentrated in Wakanda. Claw has found a way to extract that vibranium from the groundwater. We are approaching the shortcut to Fort Han Garrison. Use the pressure plates to activate the terminal to a secret passage. I may have put a timer on it just in case you got to go. Our passage, is it? I remember you saying I was not allowed. <laughs> if that were true, you would not even know about it. I was not about to make it easy for you. Makes things interesting. Now that I know you like it, I won't. Those men are here! How did Kor's people get inside the pass? They must have stolen Kimoyo beads. I will track the ones they used. Shut them out of the network. This will take us near the border. from the hack tower. I'm having trouble getting through. Apologies for the turbulence, your highness. I'm still familiarizing myself with your little network. Is this the man who fancies himself the general of a corporate army? <laughs> Ulysses Claw, at your service. When I find you, I will have you begging for mercy. You won't receive. <laughs> Better hurry then, Orphan King. I won't wait forever. He's toying with us. Brother, I know where he is. As do I. The Kimoyo Network Control Center. That sounds bad. If Claw gets full access to the network, it means he could cripple our communications. Or worse, turn all our technology against us. Change of plans. Avengers! Run! Here we go again. Have you met this Ulysses Claw in person? Not yet. Which he should be thankful for. More corrupted vibranium. We should destroy it.
more of God's men. Second counts. We are heading down to the control center. What of the other towers? I sent the Talon jet and Okoye and her team are on their way. But Claw has left me completely blind from here. Then we shall be your eyes. And my claws. <laughs> Much appreciated. Why is the power still on? It's Claw. Sorry, I can't stay. Men, charge! They are targeting the Komoyo server banks. Without them, there is no Komoyo network. And no way to get it back online until we build new ones. You have to stop them. Avengers, with me. His men are attacking the access points. I need you to keep them away while I try to get back in. I can access the turrets from here. That will buy us some time. You could also overcharge the generator. An EMP would disable close forces for a short while. It would take down our turrets as well. Until you can reactivate them, yes. Just make sure they don't destroy the access points before I get them back. Leave that to me.
It didn't have to be like this, my liege. You have no more men. <laughs> there are always more men. And now I'm inside every system you rely upon. Give me your vibranium, and I won't turn your technological utopia against you. Return what you have stolen, or I will take it with blood. How about I talk to the little girl in your ear? Ask if she can see sense. Oh, I bet she's beautiful in person. I have a message for the people. See Wakanda and die. This isn't over. <laughs> Run! Get to higher ground! Now! Shuri, we need to evacuate the borderlands. Bring them all into Berenzana! We can use the conference center to house refugees. As for Claw, no one will steal from Wakanda while I rule this land. Sister, what news of the border tribes? The evacuation is nearly complete. The final tribes are being moved to the conference center as we speak. And the Jabari? The Jabari were pleased to hear that Claw compromised our evil technology and will reward him with a quick death should he ever set foot in the mountains. How generous. Hey, so if, uh, if Claw crippled your, uh, paraphrasing, hyper-advanced super-internet, are we still safe here? Birnanzana is in full lockdown. No one enters or leaves the city without my permission. We may have lost the Kimoyo network, but the palace is still running on a private hub. My lab remains functional. That means Claw's advantage is smaller than he might expect. Claw believes Wakanda relies solely on its technology for protection. My claws will prove him wrong. Okoye, has your team returned? Yes, my team. Good. I will meet you shortly. King T'Challa. Captain, are your Avengers ready? Say the word, and we'll move out. Ah, good. Bast, deliver us. Welcome back, sir. We are evacuating everyone we can. I have Nix working on automated farming as a stopgap until they can return to their villages. Excellent. Keep me posted. I am glad you are here, Romanov. Your knowledge of AIM will be instrumental in Wakanda's retaliation. Thank you for having us. It means a lot, especially to Steve. I would not dare turn away an old friend of my grandfather. Such bonds must be honored. And when the world's at stake, where will your honor lead you? Wherever the fight takes us, you have my word. I am glad you arrived safely. 
I need you and your sword sisters to escort everyone into the city. Our shield will protect them. As you wish. You have something to add? Your decision to evacuate the Borderlands has been a controversial one. Some believe you are scared of Claw. Have you lost faith in me? I did not say I agreed with them. But any men capable of bringing down the Kimoyo network is a bigger threat than we first anticipated. I will bring Claw and his thieves to justice. You have my word. King T'Challa, may I have a moment of your time? It is of the utmost importance. Uh, I hate it when he does that. Yes, sir. What is this? Has your curiosity finally got the better of you? Perhaps you will reconsider your thoughts against superstition, as you call it. That is your domain, sorcerer. I have other pursuits. Tamisa Saki. My bonds have grown too weary to chase the mighty panther through the palace. So you claim. Now tell me what you need. It is what you need, my king. I am certain to know you have not sought my counsel in these trying times. Bast walks with me, Zawalvari. We will deal with these foreign invaders through blood, sweat, and metal. I have no need for your dark magic. Oh. Then what of your Kimoyo network and the technology it turned against you? You should embrace your spiritual side not continue to neglect it. Enough. I will call upon your wisdom when needed. Until then, enjoy the comforts gifted to you. As you wish. May you walk as swiftly and strongly as past, my king. We must assess the damage to the Komoya network. Now I can see why you'd fight so hard to protect this place. Especially from guys like Claw. That guy sure is a blemish on the... Well, Flemish. <laughs> Nazi father, Belgian citizenship. Studied in Delft, of all places. Uh, Delft. My ancestors have all dealt with colonizers before. Claw will end no differently. Oh, I don't doubt that for a second. Dr. Banner, does Shuri have you helping with network repairs? Uh, well, first, I'm, I'm trying to just make sense of it all. It's a bit of a rabbit hole. Ah, yes. <laughs> My sister does not always come into a code. It is quite frustrating. My king. Where are we with getting the Komoyo network back online? Klau has done a lot of damage. A few of us are headed out to see what we can salvage. Rebuilding it will take time. Take Adora Milaje with you for protection. Thank you, my king. Now you are sounding like me. Hey, it's Shuri. I need you in the war room. Now. The River Tribe believe they have discovered the source of corrupted vibranium. Well, one of the sources. Good news for once. Not exactly. Claw has deployed many violent machines that tear through the Earth's crust with ease. They will burn down Wakanda if left unchecked. Then we must act quickly. Give me the coordinates. Way ahead of you, brother. 
The award table has everything you need. Good work. Without the Kimoyo network, we have to rely on Wakandan citizens for reports on close movements. We need the network back online, sister. I am working on that. Until then, Takami, the River Tribe's lead scientist, will meet you nearby the machine he believes is causing the corrupted vibranium and explain more. Understood. Tami Sasaki, this is Takami. Do you read? We hear you, Takami. What is wrong? Close men. They found us spying on his machine. They have us surrounded. We are on our way. Hold fast. Takami should not have put his life at risk for this. How else were we going to learn about the corruption machines? I would have found a way. That is my responsibility as king. <gasps>
my king. The machine is through that tunnel. From what I can tell, it is some kind of uh, f fracking device. To mine for vibranium outside of the mound. Hmm. Thank you, Takami. Oh, you shall get your people back to safety. <laughs> that was fun to watch. How are your people faring without a Kimoyo network, Orphan King? You think you are clever. I've had a decade to play with Vibranium. I was bound to learn a few tricks. Your black market Vibranium will never match Wakanda's. <laughs> I agree. Why do you think I'm here? What has Claude done? The destruction here. We will fix it. We always do. There's the machine! My focused underground sonic emitter. If you won't give me vibranium, I can take it. You can certainly try. Your fuse is corrupting the vibranium so badly desire. A negligible percentage. The rest will be mine. Target the leg! Get to destabilize it! You know where, Claw. I will make sure of it. Now that we know what is corrupting vibranium, our people will be able to track the rest of the fuses. Do not put our people in any more danger. I will find these fuses and destroy them myself. Why can't you just... That is an order, sister. Oh, fine. I will gut him where he stands. Let me see it. And I might not stop you. This is a message for the princess.
It would appear not every Wakandan is a warrior after all. Uh, I'm extending an invitation, Princess. Come to me alone, or your people will die. Now, you keep me waiting, and I'll pay them off one by one. See you soon. Can I gut him now? Those symbols behind him. That is Azuri's temple, yes? Yes. But you are not going. I am. You want to walk powerless into a trap of that madman's making? Those are my lab techs. Zawavari gave me everything I needed to know about that temple. My team knows Vibranium better than anyone. The only trap I'm walking into is one of my own making. Let me do this, brother. See your plan through. Really? We do not have time for this. Wrap a jet and go. I want to follow her. Quietly. She is my sister. And those are my people. If something happens, I must be there to pick up the pieces. Koye, are you receiving? Loud and clear, my king. I have disabled the locator beacon on the jet. Fury should not know you are following. Excellent. You will be landing in a remote area west of Asuri's temple. Bast guide you. A Dorimilaje trainee was accompanying Shuri's technicians. Her name is Ayo. We have not heard from her, and she was not in the Medmen's ransom video. I will watch for her. Thank you, beloved. The tracker is live, but the princess's signal is weak. She must have gone underground through the cave pass. Except that Claw has people following her. There is a pocket of their forces between you and she. I will handle it. Yeah. Get 
Atlas beginning. The gate pass she took us through this gate. We're almost to the temple. I will let you know when we re-emerge. Understood. I think you could have let Princess Shuri know you were following her. You'll disapprove of this decision, or all of them. I can tell you have something to say, Captain. The princess just seemed like she had a plan. And it is my job to make sure that plan does not get my sister killed. Hey. I hear you. I want everyone to get out of this safely. Then we are agreed. Okoye, report on Shuri's current location. She has not moved in a few minutes. She's about 500 meters from the temple. My king, the princess has gone inside. Understood. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Not just yet, Panther Cub. He knew we were coming. Deal with his men, boss. Strike that! Ah! the door. I know another way in. Where to? Around to the back of the temple. There is another entrance. Yeah. 
Hey, when was the last time Wakanda installed a normal, not booby trapped back? There should be a target on that pillar. I told you to come alone, princess. Hurry, inside. I had that. Why are you still here? I could not let you go alone. What if I find the girl before you reach me, Panther? Hmm. <laughs> Brother, I cannot believe this is how little you trust me. You are not the one I must trust. believe you were invited to this party. Let them go! My father came to your beautiful country when I was a child. He had heard about the mythical vibranium. And at first, the Black Panther listened to my father, showed him Wakanda. Release them! My father asked for a gift to save his dying nation. But the Black Panther said they had no vibranium to give. Your father did not ask. He demanded, he threatened, and Azuri the Wise said no. Oh, oh, he did not just say no, your highness. He slit my father's throat and left him to bleed out on the ground you now stand on. That Panther is dead. So you will have to do. You and your people. No! Brother! What was that? Everything is shaking! Finish the job, boys! That psychopath killed him and ran away. Goodbye, sweet prince.
I needed an insurance policy. Okoye, we are coming home. My sister will need medical attention. Yes, beloved. And get me the next of kin for the lab technicians. I will. Claw will pay for this. I promise. I am here. You had something to tell me. I could not sit by after what Claw did. What you watched him do. The barrier he brought up, I... So I hacked into his communications. He is talking to AIM Scientist Supreme, Monica Rappaccini. I think we should listen in. Don't you? Patch us through. I keep an eye on all of my operations, Ulysses. The reports from your inferiors are concerning, at best. You destroyed a heritage site? Is that correct? I made a statement. Now, Wakanda knows AIM won't back down until we get the Vibranium we deserve. Ancient Wakanda knew more about Vibranium than anyone in my company. You may have just burned thousands of years of research notes and experiment logs to the ground. Perhaps I just believe more in the capability of AIM than- I am building an army to fight an alien invasion no one believes we can survive. Your daddy issues are no longer my concern. Excuse me, you little- You're fired. Good luck with your crusade against the Panther without my company's protection. Men, we have been forsaken. But no matter. History will prove who the victors are. What we are not given, we will take. Storm the Vibranium Mound! Brother, the Mound! He's actually storming the Mound! Then he is both reckless and vulnerable. The Avengers and I will stop him. Please! They cannot have died in vain! I promise you. Shuri, what is happening inside the mound? Claw and his loyalists have barricaded themselves in with their fused devices. Are there any Wakandans in there with them? The mines are unmanned. Unprocessed vibranium is toxic to the human body. And you want us to run straight into it? I want Claw and his men out of my mines. We have nanotech pills to help with the rest. If Claw turns on all his fuses inside the mound, he will corrupt vibranium at its source. We will not give him the chance. Dr. Epicini may be finished with Claw, but she is not done with Wakanda. She has sent AIM forces to storm Beninzana. As long as the shield around it stands, the city is safe. We cannot let Claw poison the Vibranium Mound.
This is the door we gotta bust down? The closest one to the first fuse device. Yes. Why don't we let Claw know we have arrived? It is only polite. the Avengers. Do not let them near the fuses! Desperate already, Claw. You have lost your touch. Keep moving! Do not let Claw's minions stop us! Your fuses, Claw! T'Challa! Claw is powering up his fuses! We will dispatch them quickly! Stay substantial. You will have to be fast. Where's the closest fuse? Through the vibranium filters. Prepare yourselves. This will be difficult. These vibranium particulates start affecting us? With the nanotech pills we gave you, you will manage just fine. That does not mean you should not hurry. We are through. Heading for the filtering chambers now. Excuse me, what happens if we touch the glowy bits? You will be broken down into your component molecules. If it helps, your death would be instantaneous. Why would that help? <laughs> you sure this is the quickest way there? Unfortunately, I am.
close. of your ancestral mountain. Pathetic. You're close to the first fuse. Should I mute him? Let him fume. I need to monitor the progress of his madness. could see me now or yours my king at least my father could still look me in the eye after all I've done aim for the feet right right Dead limb from robotic limb. mechanism. That is 
just one. I have many more. T'Challa, this is bad. What is it? I'm seeing more fuses than we anticipated powering up inside the mount. A lot more. The plan remains. Defeat them. He will not go any further. Challenging the Panther. Okay. Holy hell. It is the heat sink for the mines. Close fuses are putting it into overdrive. This is the only way to the power banks? The only one that gets you there in time. Please hurry. door to the power banks.
The barrier and fuse devices are both being powered by the kiln's generators. So I can get them onto the Kimoyo network. And make them self-destruct. But once Claw realizes what you are doing, he'll destroy the generators. What do you need from us? Protect those generators at all costs. And get close to one or two of these hijacked turrets while you're at it, okay? I can multitask. <laughs> Judy, take over the power banks. We will give you as much time as you can. Now! Stop that! Guess he figured out what I'm up to. Let's <laughs> go. 
safe, or I can't stop Claw. I have got it! Me? Hydranium doesn't belong to you! It is mine! And I will happily go through you to take it back. You are right. Vibranium does not belong to me. City. Big. These aren't Claw's loyalists. Aim is here. As long as the shield is up, the city's fine, right? Yes. But Wakanda is not just Pirn and Zana. We must remove every last invader from within Wakanda. Gladly. <laughs> We're almost there. Get outside! <laughs> to the shield's weakest point. I, uh... Vibranium has ripped Claw apart. He is pure sonic energy now. How do I defeat a man made of sound? If... If I reverse the polarity of the sound dampeners around Wakanda, they can amplify sound instead. Get the wavelength just right, and it will resonate with the sonic waves that make up Claw. You could beat him. To get enough power for a maneuver like that, you would have to drop the shield around the city. Only until you defeat Claw. Wakanda can protect itself until then. Trust your people. Trust me. Do it. Brother, we need to 
Shuri, what of our people? Some injuries, but everyone is all right. We beat them back beyond the shield. Dora Milaje are picking off stragglers. We were able to do it. Together. You are right. Say that again, so I can record it. <laughs> Maybe later. For now, I am coming home. Chala. How old are you that you're still playing hide and seek? <laughs> Thank you all for coming. Just tell us what you are going to tell us, Drama King. I asked you here to announce I will be joining the Avengers in their fight against advanced idea mechanics. What about the job of Black Panther in? Wakanda. Your panther will not turn his back on his people. But I acknowledge that my attention would be split. And Wakanda needs, no, deserves more than that. Wakanda deserves a leader that believes in them more than anyone else alive, who trusts they will fight for their country and who knows what they need even before they do. Wakanda, is this how you greet your queen regent? I just wanted to try that. Hey there, New York. Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man here. Wanted to give a bit of a life update since I'm sure you're wondering where I've been the past couple of weeks. <sighs> Come on, guys. I'm talking to my fans right now. Sorry about that. But yeah, I've been a little busy and I've sort of not really kind of been working with the Avengers. It's like a side hustle. It's hard taking down a multinational corporation especially when your team has been deemed outlaws in the public eye. But we still find time to enjoy ourselves outside of work. I've actually been able to do a lot more recreational stuff since I joined them. Here's a secret from yours truly. The Avengers? Surprisingly normal outside of bad guy butt kicking. They're like this big family of heroes, all working together and helping out, but still finding the time to have fun. Not that I've been goofing off. It's still serious work fighting alongside the Avengers. But you know how it is. Saving the city all the time. All by yourself. It gets kind of lonely. <sighs> I've met so many cool people now. I 
I've been to so many wonderful places. And you know I'd never leave New York. You guys are always my number one. But the Avengers are like no other friends I've ever had. It's been kind of great. Sorry, I'm totally getting ahead of myself. Uh, let me back up a little bit. Start from the beginning. This is safe, right? Yeah, totally safe. What could possibly go wrong? Okay, I did not think this one through. Hill should be in contact soon to fill us in. Hey guys, we have a visitor. Hey. You know, you guys should really consider getting a doorbell or a front door. <laughs> Can I come in now? Okay, Spider-Man, let's talk. You two know each other. <laughs> Spider-Man's been fighting baddies in New York for like, ever. Sorry, I spent the last five years frozen and in space. I was living in a trailer. With internet? Well, I'd say I'm insulted, but 50% recognition ain't bad. AIM had a pretty extensive file on him. No ID though. You cover your tracks well. Coming from you, it, you can't see it behind the mask, but I'm totally blushing right now. Still doesn't explain why you were hanging off our helicarrier mid-flight. Yeah, I need Tiny Dancer. She helped my friend slip some AIM intel to the Resistance a while ago. I was hoping... I'm listening. Right, so, I think AIM's working on something big. Like, <clears throat> chemical weapons big. I'm having trouble getting specifics because every file I've pulled off their servers is super redacted. The number of black bars on these things puts some modern art to shame. And? And? I'm trying to track down their supplier, but... I, I need Tiny Dancer to break AIM's encryption so I can get into one of their facilities. I can handle the rest myself. Let us take a look first. If you're right about what AIM's got planned, we'll help you get into that facility. Hang out until we're ready to go. Tony? Nat? It's really not a big deal. It's just to get in... You're still walking. Okay. Don't worry. I'm an expert in hanging out. Get it? Hanging? Well, I thought it was funny. You know you guys don't have to come with me, right? We know. <laughs> still gotta help, though. It's what we do. And, uh... You don't have to wear that mask around us if you don't want to. It's not really about me. There are people back home that I need to protect. And the mask helps me do that. Hey, I get it. No one back home knows I'm Miss Marvel either. Except my Abu, of course, but, um, mask or no mask, we all need people who have our backs and really get us. Even the weird parts. Uh, especially the weird parts. <laughs> in any case, you should check out the place. Thor and the Hulk are competing in the harm room, but I'm sure you could kick him out. The harm room? <laughs> Is that name literal or ironic? You'll see. Welcome to the Chimera, Spider-Man. Thanks. <sighs> Let's hope this was the right call, Pete. Excuse me while I refer to him as Anthony Masters for the rest of this mission. That skull for brains was on my undercover team when he decided to go mercenary. A lot of good people died that day. I plan on reminding him he has blood on his hands. Woo! Jarvis, we got any bogeys in the area? Small patrol ahead. Likely a preliminary guard for the clone's base. Let's give them a hello so they don't ruin our surprise.
North Direction report, I'd be curious to hear what happened between you and Mr. Masters from your point of view. We were doing recon on this arms dealer, somewhere in Nigeria. S.H.I.E.L.D. heard they might have gotten access to alien weaponry. The intel seemed good. Turned out, it was too good. Masters was working for the Steeler. He was bringing our S.H.I.E.L.D. weapons and armor straight to him. There are the guards. Don't let them stand in your way. Agent Morales. Right. Of course I didn't finish. <laughs> um, my team walked into a trap. The arms dealer only wanted our weapons and armor, not the people holding them. So they just started picking us off. I don't know how many masters took out himself, but it doesn't really matter, does it? <laughs> okay. You're headed for the base's two main hangars. We're trying to cut off Masters' only means of escape. First up, the containers he uses to deploy troops and supplies. All troops to the east hangar! Uh, you have got to be kidding me. Patch me in, Jarvis. I want to talk to him. Connected. Hey, Masters. Remember me? Morales. Still not dead. Avengers, you need to find him.
Are you certain? Uh, no. But I can finish this. I am here to assist you in any way that I can. Thank you. And I am sorry, Avengers. I, I didn't expect it to hit me this hard. Turn comms back on, Jarvis. I want to be able to hear this. Understood. when S.H.I.E.L.D. sends the Avengers to clean up their messes. As if you could love anything. You're broken. Avengers, take them down. You wanna just give up while you're ahead? No? Suit yourself.
possess is clinical huh. I know they're gone for good but maybe now he is too nice work Avengers Mark Raxton, a junior executive at Allen Chemicals, turned himself in to authorities today, claiming that he was solely responsible for the company's involvement with AIM scientist Dr. Spencer Smythe. Smythe and Advanced Idea Mechanics are both under investigation after raw footage of advanced synthoid testing was leaked to the Daily Bugle's website, raising questions as to whether AIM's practices are not just unethical, but illegal. The Bugle's internal investigation into who uploaded the live stream is still underway. Hey, Liz. Are you okay? <sighs> sort of. Uh, still processing, I think. Mark always had a bit of a protective streak. I guess I never expected him to do all this just to save my career. I mean, working with AIM? Even knowing what they were really doing, it just... And you wouldn't have lost that internship in the first place if it wasn't for Peter Parker. Peter? Peter had the right idea this whole time. AIM is dangerous. We should have exposed them a lot sooner. So... you don't hate him? <laughs> I mean, I did it first. Nobody likes losing their job. But this is bigger than both of us. And now I have something to offer the Resistance. What's that? Maybe Allen Chemicals can't officially work with the Resistance, but they can at least spare one of their top biochemists, me. <laughs> Parker said you were as tough as you are smart. He was right. So what about you, huh? What's next for Spider-Man? Well, first I'm gonna go back to New York and get a decent slice of pizza. After that, I guess it's back to the old grind. Speaking of, I have work to do, so it's cool if you want to go, like, have some superhero bonding time or whatever. Oh, that's okay. I'm still not used to having people around. I've always flown solo. Or swung, I guess. So... Working with the Avengers has been kind of terrifying, but also nice. I don't know. It's strange. Having people want to be around me and wanting to be around them, too. <laughs> That's called having friends, Spidey. You should try it sometime. I think you'll like it. You did good out there. Yeah? And you know, if you wanted to stick around on a more permanent basis, I don't think anyone would mind. Uh, Bruce only requested that you limit your lab time to once a day and during work hours. I... I'm really flattered. But I've still got my own messes to clean up back home. New York isn't gonna save itself. Still, 
If you need anything from me, give me a call. And I'll be there. Oh, yeah? You're not gonna go all, I work alone on us? <laughs> I guess it's not the worst thing in the world to have a couple of superhero friends on speed dial. Uh, actually, if you don't mind, could I get a lift back to New York? Kinda far for a ride chair. Hey, Aunt May. Sorry I'm late. I was hanging out with some new friends. Hey, don't sound so surprised. You know what? I did have a nice time. But you know you're always my preferred company. Sure, I'll grab some tamales on the way home. Yeah, I'm glad I had a good day too. Love you. <laughs> 